a bright, sunny day, and Buster wants to play outside. But what's this? He's left his toys all over the floor. Buster knows he should clean them up, but he really wants to go and play. Whoa! Buster's cleaning up all the toys super fast. But not very well. Oh dear, he's knocked that glass over. And now his mopping up has left water everywhere. Soon, Buster is outside playing. What was that? <laughs> Mommy slipped on all the water. Mm. Oh dear, the room is still such a mess. Buster feels really bad for not cleaning up well. But he can make it all better. He just has to clean up properly and take his time to do it right. Mommy and Buster can do it together, like it's a game. <laughs> Chores are so much easier to do when you find the fun in them. And they're so much faster if you work together. There, Buster is even cleaning up that drink he spilled. Perfect! The room is all tidy at last. Now Buster and Mommy can go and play ball together. Hooray! <laughs> it's time for the annual nature race, which Daddy Bus has organized. This is going to be so much fun! Ash and Buster are going to work together. They need to race through the woods as fast as they can. And the first one back gets the shiny trophy. Get set, go, go, go! Bandit has overtaken Buster and Dash. He really wants to win. What is he up to? <gasps> He's changed the sign. So Buster and Ash are going the wrong way. Oh no. Huh? There's no more path. This can't be right. And what's that? A huge tire print. Ash thinks it must be a monster. <laughs> nope, don't worry, Ash. Monsters aren't real. Uh-oh, I think they're lost. But they need to keep going. They're slowing down. Oh, dear. They're stuck in the mud. What are they going to do? <gasps> what is that? It sounds like a m monster! Ah! <laughs> ah! <laughs> Don't worry! It's just a monster truck! And they're very friendly! She's pulling Ash out of the mud! Wow, she's strong! And now it's Buster's turn. <laughs> this monster truck is called Mira. She's lost too, just like them. Buster says they can work as a team. There's Naughty Bandit. He's almost at the finish line. But look, Buster and his friends are ahead. They ended up taking a shortcut. <laughs> <laughs> Hooray! Mira won the race! But she couldn't have done it without her new friends! And she's won the trophy! Yippee! But Mira feels sad for Bandit being on his own! She knows what that feels like! Bandit feels bad for cheating in the big race! Don't worry, Bandit. There's no need to cheat when you have friends by your side. 
And it's always fun to make new friends. Buster is so excited to go play with his best friend, Scout. What'll they play today? Ooh, Grandpa has a remote-controlled car. Buster's going to control it first. Vroom, vroom. Look at it go. Now Scout wants to go. But Buster wants to keep driving. Uh-oh, Scout doesn't think that's fair. She wants a turn. Oh dear. Now they're fighting over the remote. They both want to control the toy car. Oh no! The car crashed and broke. Now nobody can play with it. Buster and Scout are upset with each other. They're not playing anymore. It's so sad when friends argue. But wait, I think Grandpa has an idea. He's giving the remote to Scout and the toy car to Buster. They'll need to work together to fix it. <laughs> oh, now they've made up. Oh. Friends always <laughs> forgive each other. <laughs> there! Now they can both control the car. Daddy Bus and Buster are driving across the hills. Oh, look! It's a baby deer. What's it running from? Huh? <gasps> it's tracks in the train. Oh, no. Oh. What's wrong? Traxon can't stop. Quick, Buster and Daddy Bus to the rescue. Oh no, he's speeding up. Daddy Bus is calling Otis the police car. This is an emergency. Ah, there's a branch on the tracks. Daddy Bus swoops in and moves it. Hooray! Well done, Daddy Bus. Looks like the tracks change directions up ahead. Daddy Bus and Buster are pulling the levers to change the direction of the tracks. But oh no, Terry is crossing the tracks. Change them quick! That was close. Now Traxon is going round and round. He's getting dizzy. Oh no, watch out! Phew! Daddy was just in time. Looks like Buster has a plan. They need to direct Traxon towards the hill. The hill is slowing him down. He stopped! Hooray! Go, Buster! <laughs> Otis has arrived on the scene. This doesn't look like an emergency. Who there, Buster? Oh, wow, a soccer ball. Look, it's Scout. She wants to play. Great kick, Buster. Nice one, Scout. Who's that driving down the road? It's Tony the truck. Oh, no, Buster. Be careful where you kick the ball. Watch out for Tony. Ouch, that must have hurt. I hope Tony is okay. Buster, you have to be more careful. Watch out for that pin. Oh, no. It's punctured Buster's tire. Look, Scout. Tony the truck needs help. I know who we need. Oh. Yay, Amber the Ambulance. Good job, Scout. It sure is an eventful day. I hope you feel better soon, Tony. Whoa. 
Oh, Buster, that sure looks painful. Don't worry now, it was only an accident. Tony is in safe hands and Amber will come back shortly. Buster, look, it's Amber. Let's get you fixed. <sighs> Off to the garage, Buster goes. Uh -huh. Oh, wow, Tony Ooh. looks great. <laughs> Buster's getting a new tire. All fixed. Hmm. Oh, Buster, ah. accidents happen. Be more careful next time. <laughs> Great kick, Buster. <laughs> oh, no, not again. Buster is being more careful. Look left, look huh? right. Now that's more like it. Well done, Buster. Over here, Buster. <laughs> That's a pretty looking flower. What a bright sunny day it is. Buster is very happy today. And look there, a nice juicy red apple. Better hurry, Buster, or you'll be late for school. The lesson has already started, quick. Oh dear, I don't think the teacher is very happy with you being late, Buster. You better pay attention now to the lesson. Looks like today you're going to have to drive through the cones. <laughs> Here comes Robin. Pay attention, Buster. Don't get distracted. Oh dear. The teacher doesn't look happy at all. It's time to drive through the cones. Orange bus is going first. Slow and steady, that's it. The teacher looks pleased. Now it's your turn, Buster. Good luck. Whoa, slow down, Buster. You're knocking the cones over. Try and stay inside the cones. Oh dear, that's not what you were told to do. That will teach you for going too fast. The teacher is very disappointed. It's the end of school. Time for everyone to go home. I think Buster is sad that he didn't do what he was told in the lesson. Maybe he should go and say sorry to the teacher. The teacher looks really tired. It's been a long day for her, too. I think she could use some cheering up. Now what could you... The apple! Great thinking, Buster. That's very kind of you. And you've cheered up the teacher. Come on, Buster. You can do it this time. Slow and steady. That's right. You're concentrating and doing it really well, Buster. You did it! Nice work, Buster. Well done. Hey there, Buster. Oh, wow, look at that. You're in the Wild West. <laughs> and check out your cowboy hat. That must be the sheriff with his shiny gold star. Oh, look, a lasso. Great work, Buster. Now you're a proper cowboy. There's Terry. Tip your hat, cowboy, and say hello. I don't think Terry looks too impressed. Wait. <gasps> It's Bandit Bus. And what's that on his back? A sack? I think he's robbed the sweet shop. What a villain he is. You must stop him, Buster. <laughs> Quick, Buster. He's getting away. Chase after him. Wake up, Sheriff. There's a robber on the loose. They're speeding alongside the train tracks. Faster, Buster. You can't let Bandit escape. Wow, Bandit jumped in front of Suki the train. Wait for the train to pass and... Where did he go? Oh no, he's going the other way. That was sneaky. After him, Buster. Bandit is trying to lose Buster in the cactus field. Careful, Buster. Those are really spiky. You've almost caught him. Look out! Are you okay, Buster? Oh no, the cactus has punctured your tire. Oh no, you'll never catch him with a flat tire. Wait, huh? of course! The lasso! Rope him up, Buster. One, two, three, go! Great, you did it! You caught Bandit. And here's Sheriff Otis. I'm sure he's really grateful. There, Bandit is in the jailhouse where he belongs. 
Oh, wow! Sheriff Buster. What an exciting dream that was. Happy trails, Buster. Look, it's Bandit. He's coming over to visit Buster today. Bandit is so excited. I wonder why. Wow, what a cool dinosaur, Buster. And Bandit has one too. They're off to play at the park. They're having so much fun playing with their dinosaur toys. But wait, what's that? Could it be a dinosaur? Buster and Bandit are using their imaginations to pretend they're on a dinosaur adventure. What was that? It's a T-Rex! Run! Go, go, go! <gasps> How will they get across? Quick, the dinosaur is coming! Aha! Buster has his cowboy lasso! Go, Buster! But Bandit is a bit nervous! Come on, Bandit! You can do it! Bandit is facing his fears! Woo! Good job, Bandit! There's no way the T-Rex can reach them over here! Uh-oh! Or maybe it can! Look! They can hide behind that tree! Quick, Bandit! Wait a second! An egg? Oh! The T-Rex wasn't chasing them after all! It was looking for its egg! Oh no! It's heading towards that cliff! Quick, Buster! Phew! <laughs> the egg is safe now! The dinosaur is so grateful to Buster! What a fun game! And it wasn't really a dinosaur! It was just Diggly! And he was looking for his ball! <laughs> Everyone loves playing dinosaurs! <laughs> Roar! Roar! What a fantastic day playing at the park! Buster, Scout, Bandit, and Ash are having a race! Buster and Bandit are neck and neck! But Scout's dashed into the lead! Whoosh! Scout won! Nice work, Scout! She really is super speedy! What's that noise? Thunder? Oh no, it's a storm! They should take cover or they'll get all wet! Whoa, that was close! Ash nearly skidded into his friends on the wet grass! Wait a minute, that gives Buster an idea! Whoosh! <laughs> Skidding through those muddy puddles is great fun! They could play a game, see who can skid the furthest! What a great idea! Bandit is going first! Swish! He skidded all the way over there! But Scout thinks she can do better! Vroom! Whoa! Scout went even further than Bandit! Now it's Ash's turn! He's so little, he's spinning round and round! He's all dizzy, but he's gone the furthest yet! Last up, it's Buster! Whoosh! Uh-oh, he's getting out of control! Whoa! Oops! Buster splashed Mommy with mud! Looks like it's time for all the little vehicles to get back home! They're back at Buster's house in no time! But wait, they can't go inside until they're all cleaned up! Mommy's going to use the hose to wash all the mud off! Splish splash! <laughs> 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 
And there, now all four of them are clean again. But even so, that skidding race was so much fun. It's Buster the bus. <laughs> Looks like he's having fun flying that kite. Look out! Oh no! Scout accidentally hit Buster, and now the kite has flown away. I'm sure Scout didn't mean it, Buster. <laughs> Look, what's this? It's a letter addressed to Santa, but it's not been delivered. I think Buster has an idea. He's going to deliver the letter himself to make sure it gets to Santa safely. Oh no, the letter! Phew, thanks for the help, Robin. Off Buster goes. It's a long way to the North Pole where Santa lives. It's cold and tough. Be careful you don't get lost, Buster. Oh dear, almost there, Buster. What's this? Oh. Reindeer tracks. <laughs> Look, it's Santa! Buster made it! <laughs> Santa's saying hello, Buster. Go and give him the letter. Buster's driven such a long way to deliver it. Let's see what it says. Whoa, it's asking Santa to give Buster a kite for Christmas. It's from Scout. What a loyal friend Scout is. I think Santa knows what to do. Well done for delivering the letter, Buster. It's Christmas morning. Wake up, Buster. Oh, there's nothing under the tree. Maybe Santa was too busy. Wait, there's a present after all. Merry Christmas, Buster. And there it is, just like Scout asked. A kite to replace the one Buster lost. Thank you, Scout. What a thoughtful Christmas gift. Go, Buster! I think Buster is sleeping again. Where are you, Buster? Look at all the huh? giant colored huh? balls and toys. Huh? It looks like a great place for an adventure. Let's see what else Buster can find. <laughs> wow, look at that teddy bear. Look how big it is. He looks soft and cuddly. Aw, that's it, Buster. Have a nice big cuddle. He looks so cuddly. Oh no, Buster. What's that noise? It's a giant claw. Huh? I think Buster is inside a giant claw machine. Buster, watch out. It's going to get you. Go, Buster. Oh no. Buster, it was just a bad dream. Look, it's Scout. It looks like Buster is still a bit shaken up. But you don't need to worry anymore, Buster. Look, Buster, Scout has something to show you. I wonder what it is. Oh no, it's a claw machine. Buster looks frightened. <laughs> Scout's not scared of it. Maybe it's fun. Don't worry, Buster. Scout's with you. <gasps> Look, Buster. It's that teddy. Why don't you try and win it? Come on, Buster. Just be brave. You can do it. Okay, Buster. Let's get this teddy. Take it easy. That looks about right. Okay, here goes. <laughs> Did you get it? Huh? What's that? Oh, it's a little yellow bus. That toy looks just like you, Buster. Huh? That makes Scout and Buster laugh. Buster has gotten over his fear of the claw machine now. what Buster's going to learn at school today. Oh, a volcano. Wow. They're going to do an experiment. The teacher is showing them what to do. First, a drop of white powder. Then three drops of food coloring. Then some vinegar to make it all bubbly. 
Wow! It looks like an erupting volcano! Isn't that amazing? Everyone is so excited! They're going to do the experiment all by themselves! What a mess! It looks like Bandit didn't do it right! Oh no! Scouts didn't go right either! Maybe Buster? Buster has made just as much mess as the others! Why isn't it working? Can Ash get it right? Buster is going to check! Ash is still putting ingredients in! Whoa! It worked! Nice work, Ash! But how did Ash get it right when everyone else's went wrong? Oh! He followed the instructions on the board! What a good idea! The teacher is proud of Ash! Now the others are going to try again! But first, they check what they need to do! One drop of white powder… Then three drops of food coloring… Then some vinegar to make it all bubbly! Hooray! It's working! The volcanoes are all bubbling over! Don't they look great? Good job, everyone! It's amazing what you can do when you follow the instructions! The teacher is so proud of everyone! Morning, Buster! Aww, look at those lovely photos of you and your mommy! Wouldn't it be nice if you got her a gift to thank her for being so wonderful? Off Buster goes to pick up something for his mommy! Oh wow! What's this? It's a giant grab machine! That teddy bear looks perfect for your mommy! I think Buster's going to try and win it! Go on, Buster, you can do it! Easy does it! Oh no, you've dropped it, Buster! Hmm. <laughs> Nearly there! There we go! Well done, Buster! Your mommy is going to love it! Oh, oh hello, little Robin! Robin has come to help Buster look for more presents for his mom! Oh, I think Robin has spotted something! What is it, Robin? Huh? Oh, a beautiful bunch of flowers! Great job, Robin! I wonder what else Buster could give to his mommy. Oh, look! A balloon! Catch it, Buster, quickly! Oh, not quite fast enough, Buster. The balloon is getting away! Go on, Robin! We all know you're good at catching balloons! <laughs> Great work! What a lovely balloon! It's got a smiley face on it! Thanks for your help! Bye, Robin! Look up ahead, Buster! It's your mommy! Aw, Buster is super happy to see his mom! <laughs> oh! And she seems pleased with her lovely presents! Aw, what a lovely day Buster's had! Moms really are the best! Buster and Ash are on holiday at the beach! Mommy Bus and Mommy Fire Truck are preparing a barbecue! And Buster and Ash are building an amazing sand castle! Whoa, those waves are really coming in! Quick, the sand castle could be ruined! Ash to the rescue! He's protecting the castle with a wall of sand! Great idea, Ash! Oh look! It's Iggy, the ice cream truck! Hooray! Oh no! Ash's wall couldn't stop the waves! They've ruined their sand castle! Buster is very sad! But Ash has got a plan to save it! Buster is too upset to help. Maybe an ice cream will cheer him up. I wonder what flavors he'll choose. Wow, that's a huge ice cream! Whoa, steady! 
Ash is still fixing the sand castle. Buster could get Ash an ice cream too, but he's upset with Ash because his wall didn't protect the sand castle. Buster's only getting ice cream for himself. Whoa! Ash has rebuilt the sand castle. Good as new! Buster now feels bad he didn't get Ash an ice cream, so he's giving Ash his. Be careful, don't drop it. Iggy gives them another cone. Now they can share the ice cream. Yum, yum, delicious. Look at those paint brushes. Buster and his friends are painting the walls in Buster's room today. How exciting. Mommy Bus is bringing them lots of different colored paints. They can paint the wall underneath the window. Hmm, what color should Buster choose? Scout has chosen purple. And Ash has picked red. And Buster, yellow, of course. Let's paint. Oops. Ash adds a red splat to match Scout's. And Buster adds a yellow splat, awesome. I wonder what Scout is painting first. It's a rocket! Awesome! Cool! Buster's go next. What's he going to paint? A bumblebee! Not on the cabinet, Ash! Now they're having a paint fight. Be careful, that paint is very messy. Oh dear, they're getting paint everywhere. What a mess. Uh-oh, the yellow paint is all over the floor. And now the purple. Yikes. Mommy Bus is wondering what all that noise is. That was so much fun. Uh-oh, they didn't realize they were making such a mess. But Buster has a plan. They can use Ash's hose to clear it up. The water is washing away the paint. Great job, Ash! Oh no, Mommy Bus is coming and they haven't finished clearing up the mess yet. Time to get all cleaned up. Ash is hosing Buster down. Splash! Now it's Scout's turn. And that looks like so much fun. And finally, Ash. Well done, everyone. Wow, the room looks completely clean. Time for Ash and Scout to head off home. Oops. Well, not completely. It's Buster the bus. I wonder what he's up to today. An Easter egg hunt. There's one Easter egg. Nice work, Buster. There's another. That's two. And three, four, five, so many! Whoa, that's a lot of Easter eggs, Buster. Mmm, they look yummy. Buster loves chocolate eggs. Tasty! Buster's eating as many eggs as he wants. Good morning, Buster. Oh dear, Buster looks very unwell. He has a tummy ache. I think he ate too many chocolate Easter eggs. Here comes Scout the car to see if Buster's okay. He looks really sick. Poor Buster. Scout is going to take him to Amber the ambulance. She'll be able to help. There's Amber. She always knows how to make little buses feel better. Hmm. Hmm. Yup, oh. 
Buster is sick, all right. But luckily, Amber has some medicine to help. Open wide, Buster. That'll make you feel better. But that's not all. If Buster wants to fix his tummy ache, he needs to eat some healthy food, like an apple. There, that'll soothe Buster's grumbly tummy. <laughs> the next day, Buster is feeling much better. Oh, hey, it's Diggly the Digger. What's Diggly got there? Uh-oh, I think Buster has had enough chocolate Easter eggs for one Easter. <laughs> Buster is having fun splashing in some very muddy puddles outside his house. Look, it's Grandpa Bus. Oops, now they're both covered in mud. But Grandpa has a plan. Where's he taking Buster? They're at the car wash to get cleaned up. Hooray! It looks like the car wash is all out of bubbles. Aha! There's the soap! Grandpa adds a small squirt. And Buster turns on the car wash. Go, Buster, go! Hang on. That's a lot of soap, Grandpa Bus. <laughs> Buster is covered in soapy bubbles. How funny! That was a very good joke, Grandpa. Now it's Grandpa's turn to get cleaned up. Looks like Buster's got a plan. He's getting his own back. Grandpa is covered in soap. He looks very silly. Look, Terry the tractor is here for a wash. Whoa, go easy, Buster. The bubbles are overflowing. Oh dear, what a soapy mess. Otis doesn't look very happy. Time to clear up the mess. What a silly day. Buster and his friends are at school. And today, they have a very special visitor. It's Mommy Fire Truck. Hooray! <laughs> She's here to show them what a fire truck does. When a building is on fire, you have to call a firefighter as quick as you can. What happens next? A hose is attached to a water hydrant and the water puts out the fire. Yippee! It's time to practice. They have to knock the cones over with a jet of water. Ash is first. Yay! Well done, Ash! And Scout. Oops. That's better. Well done! Now it's Buster's turn. Wow! Watch out, Buster! That was a great day, but now Mommy Fire Truck needs to get to work. <laughs> Goodbye, Mommy Fire Truck. Thank you. Now it's the end of the day, and Buster is heading home. Bye, Scout. Bye, Ash. <gasps> what is that? It's smoke. Where could it be coming from? <gasps> oh no, it's a fire! What should Buster do? He needs a firefighter. Buster is getting Mommy Fire Truck to help. Teacher will take care of Ash. Go, Mommy, go! There's the fire. Aha! And there's a water hydrant. Next step, attach the hose. Oh 
Oh no! Quick! <gasps> Phew! The fire is out! Yippee! <laughs> oh. What great teamwork! <laughs> it's the next day at school! Teacher is calling Buster up to the front. What could it be for? Look! Mommy fire truck! She's here to thank Buster for all his help and award him with a special fire truck hat. Go, Buster! Hey there, Buster. That's a great looking shark poster you've got there. Oh, Buster's looking really tired. I wonder what he'll dream about. What's this? Fins? Coral? Oh, wow, Buster! I think you're under the sea! Look at Buster go! The ocean is his new playground! Isn't it beautiful? Go for it, Buster! Jump into the sky! This is so much fun! Wait, what's that? It's a huge fish! Quick, Buster, hide! Oh, look, he's not big at all. He's tiny. It's okay, Buster. Nothing to worry about. But what's this? It's Sham the Shark. Look at all those sharp teeth. Hide, Buster. Quit. Oh, no. Buster has spun around the little fish, and now he's heading right for the shark. Sham the Shark seems very keen to make friends. But it looks like everyone is scared of him. Quick, little fish. Hide next to Buster. Wait a minute, the shark looks sad. Really sad. You know, Buster, I think that Sham is lonely. He was just being friendly. He doesn't have any friends. That's right, Buster. Go and say hello to him. See, he just wants someone to play with. Buster and Sham are having so much fun. The ocean is a great place to play chase and to make new friends. Look at them go! Oh, Buster's waking up. It was only a dream. You don't have any fins now, Buster. You're back to being a bus again. What a lovely underwater adventure. Buster and Grandpa are visiting the Christmas Winter Wonderland. Look at all the amazing stalls. Wow, Buster really wants to win that teddy bear. He's asking Grandpa if they can play. They get three throws to knock down the cans. Oops, Buster missed. Oh dear, that's all three of his throws. He's having another go. Oh no, he missed again. Buster's upset, but I think Grandpa can teach Buster a thing or two about throwing. The key to hitting what you aim at is to take your time. First, you take a big, long breath. Then take aim. Crouch low and throw! Whoa! Grandpa hit the cans! Now it's Buster's turn. A big, long breath. Take aim. Crouch low. And throw! Hooray! Nice shot, Buster! Now time to go win that teddy bear. Oh dear! Buster didn't take his time. He needs to take a big, long breath, take aim, crouch low, and throw! Hooray! Buster did it! Well done, Buster! And here's his prize! Buster's so proud of himself! Buster the bus has come out to play! Watch out for that red paint, Buster. Oh, Buster's driven right through it. Look, Buster, you've painted some red lines with your tires. I think Buster's had an idea. Nice work. You've painted a circle. A circle is round. 
Uh-huh. It's the same shape as your wheel, Buster. Now you've colored the circle in, Buster. <laughs> it's a red circle. Oh. oh, hey, Scout. Come and join the fun. We're learning shapes. What shape is Scout painting? It's a square. A blue square. A square has four equal sides. <laughs> hey there, Digger. Digger has come to paint shapes with Buster and Scout. <laughs> What shape will Digger paint? <laughs> Digger isn't quite as fast as Buster and Scout. It's okay, Digger will be finished soon. It's a triangle. A triangle has three sides. <laughs> a yellow triangle. <laughs> Digger took so long to paint a shape that Buster and Scout have fallen asleep. Wake up, you two. What other shapes can we draw? A green rectangle. Great work, Buster! A gold star! That looks fantastic, Scout! <laughs> and a lovely pink heart! <laughs> Digger is painting a diamond! <laughs> oh, wow! Look at all the colors go! It's a wonderful rainbow diamond! So many different colored shapes. Learning the shapes was so much fun. We made a square, circle, triangle, star, heart, rectangle, and a diamond. Well done, everyone. Buster is packing his bag for Ash's birthday picnic. He will need a picnic blanket, something to drink. What else does Buster need? Marshmallows to toast on the fire! Thanks, Daddy Bus! Don't forget Ash's present! Buster is so excited to celebrate Ash's birthday. What's wrong, Buster? He looks a bit unwell. He really doesn't want to miss the party. Buster and Daddy have arrived. Time to play some party games together. Hmm, Buster really doesn't look well. But he doesn't want to miss out on the fun. They're playing hide and seek. Oh no, Buster is feeling really poorly. Maybe sitting by the fire will make him feel better? His friends are worried about him and want to make sure he's okay. Maybe some marshmallows will make him feel better. He can't even eat toasted marshmallows. Daddy Bus is taking Buster home to rest. But he can't forget Ash's birthday present. What is it? It's a painting set! That's very thoughtful, Buster. It's given Ash an idea. He's passing a paintbrush to Bandit and Scout. I wonder what they're going to paint. Buster is resting at home. He isn't his usual happy self. He needs to take his medicine and get some sleep to feel better. Well done, Buster. The next day, Buster is feeling a bit better now. But he's still sad he missed Ash's birthday. Oh. Daddy Bus has got Buster some warm soup. And what's that? His friends made a painting for him. Oh. And they're outside! Hooray! Buster is so happy to see his friends. And the painting has made him feel much better. It's a sunny day at Buster's house. 
and Buster and Grandpa are having a great time playing together. Mommy Bus is off to work. Will Buster and Grandpa be able to make dinner together? Whoa! Some real cooking! Buster is very excited. Let's cook! Grandpa sets up the stove. Hmm, but what comes next? Buster has an idea. It's chocolate sauce. Hmm, Grandpa doesn't think that's quite right for dinner. Let's take a look at the recipe. They've gathered all the ingredients together. Buster starts by adding some flour to the bowl. Whoa, easy there, Buster. Oops, the flour has gone everywhere. Now Grandpa and Buster are covered in flour. Buster is adding the finishing touches to the mixture. Careful the mixture doesn't go everywhere. Great job, Buster. Oops, Grandpa's tomato sauce has splattered all over the floor. And what's going on at the stove? The pot is bubbling over. Oh, look, it steamed up his glasses and now he can't see where he's going. Watch out, Grandpa. Oh dear, this isn't going very well. Grandpa and Buster are clearing up the mess. But Mommy Bus is coming home from work. Uh-oh, they still haven't made dinner. What are they going to do? Grandpa gets some fish fingers out of the freezer. Aha, this gives Buster an idea. Time for chocolate sauce. Mommy Bus is wondering what Buster and Grandpa have made for dinner, just as they're finishing up. I wonder what they've cooked. It's fish fingers and green beans. And chocolate sauce. Are you sure about this, Buster? He gives it a try. Hmm, delicious. Mommy also gives it a try. And it's surprisingly tasty. Well done. I wonder what Buster has seen. A soft play park? Oh, wow. Look, there's Scout and Digger making a bridge. Perfect for Scout to go under. What's that over there? I think it's a ball pit? Yes, it is. Go on, Buster. You know you want to. Woo! Good jump, Buster. Oh, look, it's Billy the bulldozer. He's jumping on the trampoline. He looks like he's having lots of fun. Wow, Digger, you're really good on the monkey bars. Keep going. I wonder why Billy is pushing all those soft play shapes. Oh, it's for Digger to land on. Great landing, Digger. Ooh, Scout, be careful. That looks difficult to balance. Oh, wow, Scout, you're a pro. Ready, steady, go! Who's going to win? It's very close. Scout finishes first. Well done, Scout. Maybe next time, Buster. That looked really fun. I think Digger wants to play hide and seek. Good idea. Okay, Buster. You start counting while the others hide. Oh, good idea, Scout and Billy. That's a great hiding place. Digger's going to hide in the ball pit. And Billy at the top of the slide. Coming, ready or not. Can you find your friends, Buster? Where could they be? Hmm, not there. Don't worry, Buster, you'll find them. You've just got to keep looking. There's Billy. Great spot, Buster. Only two left. That looks funny. Oh, there's Scout. Well done. One to go. Let's check the ball pit. Oh, Digger. Great hiding spot. What a great game. Buster is excited to spend the day with Grandpa. And Grandpa's looking at a beautiful cake. Grandpa has an idea. They should bake the cake together. Buster and Grandpa have come to the supermarket to get the ingredients. Flour, eggs, milk, and icing sugar. Oop, who's that? It's Mira. Along with Terry. Buster rushes to get the ingredients. But Grandpa warns him not to be hasty. Buster's looking for flour. Bingo! He's found it! And so has Mira. Uh-oh. 
Looks like they've got the same list of ingredients. Whoa, they both want the same bag. Oops. <laughs> Mira and Buster are in the race to find out who gets all the ingredients first. Buster's come to get the milk. He got it first. Off he goes, Mira. Whoops. Mira, you spooked the teacher. <laughs> she grabbed some milk, too. Slow down, you guys. Whoa. It's Grandpa and Terry. Both of them move very slowly. You sure are smart and sly, Buster. Off they go again. Oh, look. There are the eggs. Oh no, Buster dropped the eggs. And Mira spotted the last bag of icing sugar. Mira sprints off to get it. But oh no, Mira lost balance and crashed into the shelf. Buster grabs the last bag of icing sugar. But Mira's upset. Buster offers her the icing sugar. And she wants him to have it. Grandpa and Terry are surprised to see Mira in a mess. Buster's got a plan. Aw, looks like Buster and Mira shared the icing sugar to bake one big cake. The cake tastes delicious. Great teamwork, Mira and Buster. <laughs> hey there, Buster. Looks like a hot day out in the desert. Whoa, look at that ahead. A big mountain with smoke rising from the top. What was that? It's Frida the sports car. She's speeding off toward the smoky mountain. I think she wants to race. Buster and Rita are speeding across the desert together. Rita is faster. Go on, Buster, you can do it. Buster is using that ramp to jump after Rita. Phew, that was a fun race to the top. But look, what's that? Hot molten lava. I think this is a volcano. It could erupt at any moment. Uh-oh, Buster, careful of that rock. Oh no, it's fallen into the lava. Phew, nothing happened. Oh no! I think the volcano is erupting! Quick, guys, get out of there! Oh no! There are fireballs shooting out of the volcano! Look out! They'll be really hot! Oh no! Rita is stuck in the sand! Buster is being brave and going to help his new friend. Great job, Buster! Now quickly, drive away! Faster! Faster! Phew! That was a close one! Here's Ashley the fire truck. She doesn't look pleased. She's going to have to put out all the fire. Buster and Rita aren't saying anything. They didn't mean to set the volcano off. That was close, but Buster made a brand new friend along the way. Bye, Buster. Bye, Rita. Wakey, wakey, Buster. It's a brand new day. Wait a minute. There's oh. no color. That's strange. Even Robin doesn't have any color. Look, Robin. Buster made you colorful again. Well done, Buster. Oh no, that baby duckling looks sad. She's lost her color. Maybe Buster can help. Great job! The color is back again. Oh, look how happy the duckling is now. Oh look, Terry's farm has lost its color too. Can Buster help? He sure can. You've got the magic touch, Buster. Oh no, 
Knock Scout, too! Go on, Buster. Help her be colorful again. There you go, Scout. Back to normal. Look, Buster can change the color of things, too. Now the ball is green. And now the ball is purple. Buster knows how to color things in. Wow! Buster made Scout rainbow colored. Now he's rainbow colored, too. It's Buster the Rainbow Bus. It's Terry again. Now it's Rainbow Terry. And look at all the fields! And the barn! Rainbow colors everywhere! Amazing! Buster even turned the clouds different colors. There's just one thing missing. A rainbow, of course! The Rainbow Bus is driving off over the rainbow. Bye-bye! Oh, Buster, it was only a dream. And it's raining outside. Oh, I'm sorry, Buster. <laughs> Wait. Maybe you're magic after all, Buster. You made the sun come out. Buster, wake up. There's a snowflake. That can only mean one thing. It must be snowing. Wow, it is snowing. <laughs> but wait, where's the Christmas tree? That one won't do, will it? Oh, look, it's a friendly robin. I wonder what he's saying. I think he wants Buster to follow him. Oh, he wants to help Buster find a new Christmas tree. Hmm, these ones aren't quite right. Wow, that one looks amazing. Buster certainly agrees. That's a tall tree, isn't it, Buster? <laughs> Careful does it, Buster. Whoop, it's wobbling. It's wobbling. Keep going, Buster. Whoa! There we go. <laughs> Off Buster goes to carry it back to the garage. I'm not sure if that will fit. It looks very big. Be careful with the turns, Buster. Oh, no. Behind you, Buster, you've lost the tree. Look behind you. Quick, quick, quick. Hurry, Buster. Turn around. Oh, no, the tree is bouncing away. Quick, Buster, see if you can catch up with it. Now it's bouncing through all of the Christmas lights. <gasps> Quick, Buster. Do you think Buster's going to make it? Look at it, flying through the air. Go on, Buster. Lucky you, Buster. That's a relief. <laughs> it looks amazing. Oh, look, here's Terry. Here's Scout. They've come to celebrate the holidays with Buster. Well done, and happy Buster's holidays. birthday. <laughs> Mommy and Grandpa are setting up a very special party. <laughs> Don't eat the food yet, Buster. You've got to wait until your guests arrive. Oh, look, here they are. It's Scout, Ash, and Bandit. Everyone's so excited for the party. What's Bandit up to? Mmm, that cake looks yummy. Not yet, Bandit. First, we're playing party games. They're playing musical statues. They have to dance until the music stops. Great move, Scout. And freeze. Oh no! Scout is losing balance! And so is Buster! They are out of the game. It's only Bandit and Ash left. And dance! Bandit is losing balance! Oh no! He knocked Ash over so he could win. And now Ash is out of the game. But Grandpa didn't see Bandit cheating. Hmm, that wasn't very nice, Bandit. Now they're playing past the parcel. They pass the present, and when the music stops, they can take off the wrapping paper. Hooray for Ash! <gasps> Bandit has cheated again! He took the parcel after the music stopped. 
<laughs> Poor Ash! <laughs> Bandit isn't playing very fair. Buster is telling Bandit that he's making Ash feel upset. He needs to think about how his actions affect the feelings of others. It's time for some birthday cake! Blow out the candles! Go, Buster! What a feast! All the delicious food has been eaten. Well, almost. Don't worry, Ash. Have some birthday cake. Bandit feels really bad for making Ash sad. Bandit is really sorry and gives Ash his ball back. It's okay, Bandit. Ash forgives you. But remember, it's not all about the winning. It's about having fun together. Buster's kindness saved the party. Happy birthday, Buster. Everyone is having fun at the Christmas market. There's Buster. He's having a candy apple. So yummy. Whoa, Mommy Bus has a present. Is that for Buster? It is. But Mommy says to wait until Christmas to open the present. Buster doesn't want to wait. He wants to open the present now. <laughs> but he'll have to wait. Oh. Throw the ball to knock down the cans. That's Mommy's favorite game. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> oh. Oh. Uh oh. Buster's going to try to look at the present while Mommy is distracted. Buster shouldn't really be doing that. Hmm, what is inside? Here's Bandit. Oh, look out! Oh no, the present is flying off across the market. Quick, they have to get the present back before Mommy notices it's gone. The present is on the ice rink. Quick, Bandit, grab it. Oopsie. Buster will have to try and get it now. So close. Ah, oh, so close. Mommy Bus still hasn't noticed the missing present. She's having so much fun. Oh, there's the present. Can Bandit and Buster get it back before Mommy notices? Ah, whoops! Where's the present gone now? Oh, look! The Wonder Wheel! It's Ash, and there's the present! Oh, no, he dropped it! Go, Buster! Great catch! Phew! Well done, Buster! Look, Mommy put all the cans down! Hooray! She won a teddy bear! They've got the present back just in time. <laughs> Mommy is in such a good mood, she's going to let Buster look at the present, if he still wants to. Mm. Oh. Mm. But Buster has learned his lesson. He's going to wait. <laughs> it's finally Christmas Day, and Buster can open the present at last. <laughs> Whoa, it's a new soccer ball. <laughs> That's why it was so bouncy. Oh. Merry Christmas, Buster. Look, it's Buster, Scout, and Diggly. It's Christmas Eve, and they're excited for Santa to arrive with the presents. Time for bed, guys. Santa won't come if you're still wide awake. Uh-oh, it's that sneaky villain bandit bus. What's he up to this time? There's Santa, putting the presents under the tree. He must be very busy tonight. Oh no! Bandit is stealing all the presents from under the tree. What a villain he is! Now he's sneaking away. Whoops! Serves Bandit right. What's he seen now? The golden Christmas star. 
He's going to steal that as well. Oh, dear. He's trying to pull it right off the tree. Look. Now Bandit is all tangled up. It'll take him ages to get untangled. It's taken all night, but Bandit is finally free. Now he's sneaking away with the presents. Oh. Oh, poor Buster. All the presents have been stolen. He looks so upset. Bandit really is the worst. But wait, what's this? What's Bandit doing? Look, Bandit is putting all the presents back under the tree. Maybe he's not so mean huh? after all. All the presents are there after all. Buster is so happy. Merry Christmas! <laughs> There's Santa. He doesn't look very pleased with Bandit. But what's this? He puts a present for Bandit under the tree, too. Bandit earned it by giving the presents back. You did the right thing, Bandit. Merry Christmas! <laughs> Buster and his friends are on a holiday at the beach. What a fun day out! Wow, the sea looks amazing! What is that in the water? Ah! It's a shark! Buster is very scared! Oops! Watch out, Iggy! <laughs> Mommy Bus is taking a nap on the beach. Buster is trying to tell her what he saw. It had scary fins and jumped out of the water. It was a shark! Mommy Bus can't see anything. Don't worry, Buster. Everything is fine. And Mommy Bus is going back to her nap. Buster is still very scared. I wonder if the shark is still there. Ah! It's a shark! Go, Buster, go! Oops! Not again! Buster is still frightened, but he wants to get over his fear. He's going back again. There's the shark. Wait a second, what's wrong? The shark has a sore, wobbly tooth. That's why it was jumping out of the water. Don't worry, shark. Buster can help. He's trying to get Mommy's attention. She's awake. She's got her red kit and Mommy Bus to the rescue. Splat! <laughs> yum, yum! Mommy Bus is removing the shark's wobbly tooth. It's out! Hooray! The shark feels so much better now. Well done, Buster! He can't wait to show the tooth to his friend. Buster, our favorite yellow bus. But wait, you don't look as bright and yellow as usual. Oh, Buster, I think you need a new coat of paint. You're looking a little scruffy. Great idea. A trip to the paint shop will do the trick. He looks like one happy customer. Buster can't wait to get a fresh new coat of yellow paint. He's going to look good as new. Oh my, what was that? That made you jump, didn't it, Buster? Oh no, Buster's mixed up the paint cans. I don't think he's realized. Is that gonna be the right color? Here goes, Buster. A fresh new coat of yellow. Oh no, that's not yellow. Buster has been sprayed red. And I don't think he's noticed. Take a look at yourself, Buster. You're a red bus. Quickly, back to the paint shop. Oh dear, you've knocked over all the paint. How will you be able to tell which color is which? Here goes. Oh no, that's not quite right. Buster is now blue. Jessie seems very surprised. Yes, it's because of how blue you are, Buster. Maybe this time you'll come out yellow. Hmm, still not yellow. Now Buster is green. Look at how confused Tony is. Fourth time lucky. Close your eyes and wish for yellow, Buster. Oh no! Jesse and Scout still don't seem to recognize you, Buster. Buster has now been sprayed pink. Wait, 
Buster, I'm not sure that's the answer. <laughs> Buster the rainbow colored bus. I'm not sure if Robin approves. <gasps> Which paint can to choose from? Um, One of these must be yellow. <sighs> the moment of truth. Phew! There we go! That's the Buster the Bus we all know. Huh? With a bright new shiny coat of yellow paint. That was quite a colorful adventure. You're looking very cheerful today, Buster. What's that you've seen? Oh, wow! A kitten! It's adorable! Careful, Buster. You're really big, and the cat is really small. Oh, dear. I think you scared her, Buster. I wonder where she's going. You're too big to go under the fence, Buster. You'll have to go around. Where's that kitten gotten to? Uh-oh. She's stuck up in that tall tree. You've got to rescue her, Buster. A trampoline? What a good idea. That'll be a nice soft landing for the kitten. Bounce? Oh no, the kitten bounced right the way back up into the tree. Let's try something else. A net? Good idea, Buster. Careful now. Gently, gently. Oh look, a bee. Stay still, Buster. I don't think he means any harm, but oh dear. The net is broken too. Back to the drawing board. Hold on, I think Buster has another idea. Of course! Buster's brought Ashley the fire truck. She'll be able to reach the kitten with her tall ladder. There we go. <laughs> the kitten will be safe now. Oh no, I think the kitten is too scared to come down the ladder. I wonder what Buster has planned. Oh yes! The kitten's ball of wool. She'll come down to play with that. Look how happy the kitten is. Here she comes down the ladder. There, safe and sound. Nice work, Buster. <laughs> Mommy Bus and Ashley are having a relaxing day in, while Buster and Ash play tag. Oops, watch out, Buster. Hmm, maybe Buster and Ash should play outside instead. Wow, look at all that snow. What should they play? Oh, Buster knows a good game. How about cops and robbers? Ash can be the cop, and Buster can be the robber. Grandpa Bus is struggling to turn that hose on. Can Ash catch Buster? Oops, nearly. Oh, watch out, Grandpa. The hose is spraying water all over the shed. It's a bit hard to control. Oh, look. Buster has spotted the shed as a good hiding place. Off he goes, with Ash not far behind. Ash got him! Well done! <gasps> oh no! The water on the shed is freezing into icicles! They're trapped! Buster and Ash are honking their horns for help, but no one can hear them! What else can they try? Oh! Buster has a new idea! Buster is trying to push Ash through the window. But he doesn't quite fit. Oh, there's Grandpa Bus. Quick, try to get his attention. He's seen them. But, oh dear, Grandpa Bus thinks they're just playing a game. What can they do now? Oh, a fishing rod. Buster has an idea. Grandpa Bus is really looking forward to eating his sandwich. But, oh no, it's snatched away. Buster is using the fishing rod to hook the sandwich and get Mommy Bus's attention. Go, Buster! Huh? It worked! Oh. Mommy Bus has spotted them. Hmm. Mommy Bus to the rescue. What's she got there? <laughs> ah, Mommy Bus is using a hairdryer to melt the icicles. What a good idea! <laughs> but they're melting very slowly. 
Hmm, this could take a while. She's determined it will work. Nearly there. Buster and Ash are free at last. Thanks, Mommy. And everything is back to normal. Hey there, Buster. What's that poster there? Hmm, a fire truck? Sure looks exciting, doesn't it? Look, it's Ashley the fire truck. I think Buster wants to join the fire brigade. Go on, Buster. Time to get ready for your first day on the job. Just a few little changes, and... <laughs> wow! Look at that! Buster really is a fire truck. He's got a ladder, a siren, and a water hose. Uh-oh, the fire alarm. There's a fire somewhere. Ashley has to go and take care of it. You stay here, Buster. Hey, it's Tony the truck. <laughs> Watch out for that puddle! <gasps> oh no! That falling box started a fire! At the fire station! What are we going to do? <gasps> Quick, Buster the fire truck! Put that fire out! Uh-oh! The fire has spread to the roof! Keep blasting water, Buster! Hooray! Robin is here to help! And Ashley's back, too. <gasps> you can do it if you work together. Two fire trucks are better than one. Phew! The fire is out at last. Nice work, Buster and Ashley. <laughs> It's that poster again. Now it's Buster on the poster. Whoa, you really are a hero, Look, Buster. There's Buster, Mommy, and Grandpa. <laughs> I wonder where they're going on such a snowy day. Oh, wow. They're going to get a Christmas tree. So many trees. <gasps> Which one to pick? <laughs> hmm, what's this? <gasps> Buster wants the biggest tree there is. That really is tall. Now it's time to take it home. Mommy is pulling the tree in her trailer. Phew, that looks heavy. Wait, oh no! The tree is too big to fit through the front door. But wait. Grandpa has an idea. Now they're trying to take it up the ramp. Nope, that doesn't work either. But now Mommy has a bright idea. Hmm, it doesn't fit down the chimney either. But Grandpa has another idea. Three, two, one, charge! Oh dear, it still doesn't fit. It's just too big. Look, it's Scout! She's off to get a Christmas tree of her own. I think Buster has an idea. I wonder what he's thinking. Grandpa's using his saw. Whoa, they cut the big tree in two. Scout can have half and the other half will fit through the front door. Hooray! <laughs> there, that Christmas tree is just the right size for the house. It's a cold winter's night. What's Buster up to? Oh, wow, a drawing of some fireworks. Buster's so excited because tonight he's going to a real fireworks display. But wait, he's forgotten something. A nice warm hat. 
<laughs> there. Now it's time to go and watch the fireworks. <laughs> Oh, what's that? Fireworks make loud noises. Oh dear, they frightened Buster. He doesn't like loud noises. Aw, oh, poor Buster. He's shaking. What's Mommy doing? Oh, Buster's toy car makes loud noises. But that's not scary. What's that loud oh. noise? It's Grandpa with a soccer whistle. Buster loves soccer. He doesn't oh. mind that loud noise either. <laughs> <gasps> What's that loud noise? Huh? Oh, it's popcorn popping. Buster <laughs> loves popcorn. He doesn't mind that noise. <laughs> wow, the fireworks are so pretty. <sighs> Maybe loud noises aren't so bad after all. Buster's going to give it another try. Whoa! Look at those colorful fireworks! It's nap time in Buster's garage. Have a nice sleep, Buster. But who's this? It's a robot bus. Oh no, he's come to cause mischief. He's made himself look like Buster. Oh hey, Scout. She's practicing her ball skills for the football match. Here comes robot bus. I think Scout thinks it's Buster, not a robot bus. Oh dear. Robot bus has squashed Scout's football. What a nasty thing to do. Poor Scout is very upset. It's Jessie G. She's waiting for the green light. There it is. Oh, that was a close one. It's Robot Bus up to mischief again. Oh no, Jessie thinks that's the real Buster. Oh, little Robin, be careful. Robot Bus isn't very friendly. Oh, poor Robin. Bad Robot Bus. Hey, Digger. He's having fun with his building block. Oh no, Robot Bus has come to join in. He's ruined Digger's pyramid of blocks. Robot bus is causing chaos. Here's the real Buster the bus. <gasps> Waking from his nap. Oh dear, everyone is angry at you, Buster. They think Robot bus was you. How can you prove that you didn't do all these mean things? Robot bus has come to cause more chaos. Quick, Digger, there's a switch on his roof. Oh, look, he's been set to bad. Switch it to good, Digger. Well done, Digger. That seems to have done the trick. It looks like Robot Bus has gone back to normal now. Oh? <laughs> well done, everyone. That was a close one. Robot Bus could have terrorized the whole town. <laughs> Bye, everyone. Oh, whoa! It's time for the Christmas talent show. Bandit is going first. He's doing some magic tricks. Good job, Bandit. Aw, Buster looks nervous. I think he's got a bit of stage fright. Poor Buster. There's Scout. It's her turn next. She looks so excited. Oh, cool. She's going to do some juggling. Very good, Scout. Oh dear, Buster still looks nervous. He's afraid to go on stage in front of all those people. Hooray, Scout's finished her show. Now it's Buster's turn. Aw, but Buster doesn't want to go on stage. Mommy's getting worried about Buster. The stage is empty. I think Mommy has an idea. What's this? Mommy's on stage. She's encouraging Buster to come join her. They'll do it together. Here, 
Buster comes. We wish you a Merry Christmas. We wish you a Merry Christmas. We wish you a Merry Christmas and a Happy New Year. Good tidings we bring, with Buster we sing. We wish you a Merry Christmas and a Happy New Year. Merry Christmas! <laughs> oh, well done, Buster and Mommy. That was beautiful. <laughs> it's time for Buster to go to school. He mustn't forget his packed lunch. There's Scout. They don't want to be late. But who's this? A little fire truck. Buster is waving hello. At school, the teacher has a surprise. This is Ash. He's the new kid in school. He's going to be joining their class. Ash is going to Buster because he waved hello. He's so excited to have made a new friend already. Now today, the children are going to learn about parking. The teacher is showing them how to do it properly. Now it's their turn to try. Scout's got it. And Buster. Oh. Ash is sticking really close to his new friend. He's following Buster wherever he goes. He doesn't understand Buster is trying to park. Oh dear, I think he's got on Buster's nerves a bit. Buster wanted some space, but Ash didn't understand. At break time, Buster and Scout are playing. Aw, poor Ash has no friends to play with. But Buster and Scout have an idea. Ash can play with them. They're friends now after all. Now they're all playing together. Whoa, good shot, Ash. It's so nice to make new friends. What a bright sunny day it is. Oh, look, it's Diggly and CJ. They're filling up CJ's mixer with water. <laughs> what are they both up to? Look, there's Buster and Scout. Phew, what a hot day. I wonder what they can do to cool down. Whoa, Diggly and CJ are making colorful water balloons. <gasps> Looks like Buster and Scout have got an idea. Ooh, a water balloon fight. Ready, set, off they go. What are Buster and Scout planning? Oh, look, Diggly and CJ are sneaking up behind them. And splash! Uh-oh, Scout has been hit. And bullseye! Now things are getting interesting. Who is that hiding in the bushes? It's Scout. But she managed to hide just in time. It's CJ's second chance. But look, here comes Buster. He splashes CJ from behind. Quick, Buster. Oh no, CJ and Diggly have Buster and Scout cornered. What are they going to do? Aha, an umbrella. I think Buster's got a plan. CJ and Diggly take aim. But Buster is keeping dry with the umbrella. Great idea, Buster. Uh-oh, Diggly and CJ are filling up again. Whoa, look at the size of that balloon. Looks like Buster is in trouble. Wow, nice shot, Buster. That was so much fun. It's sports day at Buster's school. How exciting! First is the 100-meter sprint. On your marks, get set, go! Go, Buster! He's the winner! Hooray! That was easy! Buster is the fastest in school. 
Next up, it's the high jump. Scout's up first. Scoot, scoot. Wow, that was awesome. Buster thinks he can beat that jump. Off he goes. Oops. Don't worry, Buster. He doesn't look very happy. It's the egg and spoon race next. Get ready and go! Buster really wants to win. Whoops! Buster was going too fast and smashed the egg. Oh dear. And Ash is the winner. Well done, Ash. Buster is annoyed about losing. He really wanted to win. He's so upset that he isn't playing ball with the others. That does look fun, Buster. It's not just about winning, Buster. It's about having fun. Hooray! Now they're all having fun together. It's time to present the medals. Buster is third, Ash is second, and Scout is first! Well done, everyone! What a brilliant day! Hey there, Buster. Oh, you're looking a little tired. Buster's fallen asleep. And what's this? Whiskers, a button nose, and ears? It's Easter Bunny Buster! Looking good! I think he likes his new bunny tail. Wonder where he's off to. Off to do some Easter Bunny errands, I hope. Oh, what's this? It's a burrow in the side of that hill. I wonder where this leads. Here he comes out the other side. Oh, look, Terry Tractor is having a nap. Wow, Easter Bunny Buster has given Terry a colorful Easter egg. Off he goes to spread more Easter joy. I wonder where this burrow leads. Over here, Bunny Buster. Robin is fast asleep. Time to leave another surprise Easter egg for when Robin wakes up. Back into another burrow he goes. <laughs> Who's this? It's Jessie the Jeep. Aw, she's sleeping. Easter Bunny Buster has left another egg for her when she wakes up. Such a busy little Easter Bunny Buster. These eggs won't deliver themselves. I wonder who else Bunny Buster has an egg for. It's Digger the Excavator. Quiet, Buster. Try not to wake him. <laughs> There's an egg in Digger's bucket. Great idea, Bunny Buster. Oh, dear. I think Easter Bunny Buster is feeling a little tired. Wake up, Buster. Oh, Easter Bunny Buster was all a dream. What a shame the <laughs> eggs weren't real. But what's this? It's an Easter egg. Oh, wow. The real Easter Bunny has left Buster an Easter egg. What a lucky little bus. It's Christmas Eve. Buster is so excited he can barely stay still. He can't wait for Christmas Day. Daddy has a Christmas cracker for Buster. Who's going to win? Pull, Buster! Whoa! Well done, Daddy! But now it's time for bed, or else Santa won't come. Look! Buster's dreaming about the presents! He hopes his present will be the biggest present ever! It's Christmas Day, and Buster and Daddy are going to Mommy's house! Buster can't wait! <laughs> Buster's so excited to see the presents, he's rushing! Buster is wondering where is his present? This one is for Mommy. Daddy's present. One for Grandpa. Is the small one for him? Buster is a bit disappointed. Oops! 
the labels have come off. Oh no! Buster doesn't know whose present is whose. Buster hopes the labels are on the right presents. It's time to open the presents. <laughs> Mommy, Grandpa, and Daddy roll up to find Buster sneaking a look at the presents. Grandpa has some weights. That doesn't seem right. Mommy has some glasses, but Mommy can't see with them. And Daddy has a stethoscope. That doesn't seem right either. Oh no, the presents got mixed up. Nobody has the right presents. Hmm, maybe Buster can work out which present belongs to who. The weights must be for Daddy. He's really strong. And the stethoscope is for Mommy, because she's a vet. And the glasses are for Grandpa. Good job, Buster. It's just Buster's small present left. What is inside? Oh, a camera! Buster loves it! He's going to take a selfie with his family. Merry Christmas, Buster. Hey there, Buster. And Digger, too. That's a big sand castle you've built there. It's Sandy Seagull. Watch out, Sandy. Don't stand on the sandcastle or you'll... Oh, dear. Poor Digger and Buster. Off you go, Sandy. Cheeky bird. <gasps> what have you seen, Buster? It's a red shape sticking out of the ground. I wonder what it is. Nice work, Digger. It's a triangle. Isn't that cool? And look, Sandy has found a yellow shape, too. <laughs> it's a circle. Can you find any more, Sandy? Huh? Here's another one. This one's blue. Dig it out, quick. That's a square. It has four sides. Whoa, there are so many shapes. Triangles, circles, rectangles, hexagons. Sandy, wait, don't. Oh dear, oh dear. Wait a minute, I think Buster has an idea. Buster and Digger are collecting the shapes up. I wonder what they're going to do with them. They're stacking them up. I think they're building a tower. Just one more piece to go on the top. That's it, Buster. Gently, gently. There. Perfect. Wow. Buster and Digger have made a tower out of the shapes. What a great idea. Now they can get back to building their sandcastle. And look, Sandy has somewhere to stand that won't collapse. Nice work, Buster. Bye, Buster. Bye, Digger. I wonder what Buster and Digger are doing. <laughs> wow, who painted that? Looks like you guys want some ice cream. <gasps> Digger, <laughs> that is one big ice cream cone. Oh look, here comes Iggy, the ice cream truck. Buster and Digger want Iggy to help make them the giant ice cream. Now let's see. Oh. Cherries. Mmm, that's a delicious flavor. Let's pick that. Wow, look at all that ice cream. Right, next we need a blue ice cream. Blueberries? Perfect. <laughs> that is looking so good, Buster. Okay, yellow next. Bananas, good choice. <laughs> <laughs> you want more? Okay, this has to be the last flavor, otherwise it will be too big. Apple it is. This is going to be one tasty ice cream. <laughs> one last effort, Iggy. 
That ice cream looks quite wobbly. Steady as you go, Digger. Robin has come to get Scout so that she can find out what Buster and Digger have made for her birthday. You better follow Robin, Scout. Whoa. Happy birthday, Scout! <laughs> that is the biggest ice cream I have ever seen! Oh no, Digger! Watch out, Scout! That was close. <laughs> Blow the candle out, Scout. Now you can all tuck into the ice cream. <laughs> yum, yum. <laughs> Today, Buster and his family are having a picnic. Buster is so excited! Mommy Bus is off to get Grandpa. And whilst she's gone, Buster and Bandit need to prepare the picnic. First, they have to lay down the picnic blanket. Whoa, the wind has blown it away! It looks like a cape! It's Super Buster! Bandit wants a cape, too. And it's a tug of war. Buster is imagining that he is a superhero. Super Buster flying through the sky. It's bad guy Bandit. Mwahaha! He's stolen the picnic. Oh, no! Super Buster has got to save it. They are chasing through the sky. Go, Super Buster, go! You can catch him! Oh no! Bad Guy Bandit is aiming at Super Buster with his laser shapes! But Super Buster is too fast! Wow, look at him go! Hooray! Super Buster has saved the picnic! But what is that? It's a giant blue laser ball! Oh no! What is Super Buster going to do? Aha! He's using the flagpole as a bat! Bring it on, bad guy bandit! Great shot, Super Buster! Whack. <laughs> wow, that was such a fun game! But oh no! They've made a huge mess! <gasps> And Mommy Bus and Grandpa are on their way. What are they going to do? Quick, they've got to clear it up. As superheroes, of course. Super Buster and Bad Guy Bandit are clearing up the city. Even superheroes need to clean up after themselves. Just in time! Great teamwork, guys! <laughs> yum, yum! Delicious! And all that superhero work has left them very hungry. Hey there, Digger. What's he doing? <laughs> ah, he's building a Skittle Tower. Nice work, Digger. They look great. <laughs> oh, look, it's Buster playing with his ball. Hey, Buster, careful where you're kicking that ball. You might... Oh, no! You've knocked Digger's Skittle Tower over. Uh-oh. I think Buster has had an idea. I'm not sure Digger is going to like this. There he goes again. Buster is having a great time. Nice aiming, Buster. But I hope Digger isn't too upset that you've knocked down his towers. Are you ready for the third one? Look, there's Scout driving towards the Skittle Towers. Oh, no! Look out, Scout! Look what you've done now, Buster. Scout is trapped. You'll have to go and get help quickly. Huh? Huh? Don't worry, Scout. Buster has gone to get help. Here he comes. He's brought Digger. Digger looks very annoyed that Buster has knocked down his towers. But at least he's here to help. Look, Scout is free again. Thank goodness. Now you better get back to rebuilding those towers. If you work together, it'll take no time at all. 
That's it, Buster. Heave! Well done, Digger. That's the first tower. <laughs> Come on, Buster. Put some engine grease into it. Haha, <laughs> <laughs> I think Buster is a little tired. Buster, there's no time to rest. There's still work to be done. Get back to it. There we go. Good as new. Nice work, everyone. <laughs> oh no, Buster. Don't think about playing Skittles with your ball again now. It's a sunny day at Buster's house. Oh, look. Mommy Bus is helping a kitten with a sore leg. There. All fixed and bandaged up. Scout is here to drive to school with Buster. They are playing in the playground. Oh dear! Scout hurt her tire! Buster's got an idea. What is he up to? He's bandaged up Scout's tire with toilet roll. All fixed! Great work, Buster! <laughs> Looks like Ash wants to be bandaged up as well. <laughs> and now Scout wants her other tires bandaged up. But Buster is all out of toilet roll. Bandit has a cheeky idea. They're all taking the toilet roll. They're getting the toilet roll everywhere. This looks very messy. They're getting a bit carried away. Oh dear, they've covered the playground in toilet roll. Teacher doesn't seem very pleased. Mommy Bus is here to take Buster home. She wonders what has upset the teacher. Buster explains he was trying to help Scout like Mommy helped the kitten. Mommy will be able to bandage it properly. Time to get properly fixed up. Oh, what a beautiful day it is today. I think Buster is feeling a little hot. Hey, look. Scout has the right idea. An ice cream will cool you down, Buster. And it looks delicious. Do you hear that, Buster? It sounds like Iggy, the ice cream van. Hey there, Iggy. Buster wants an ice cream. Look at all the different flavors. Chocolate chip, vanilla sprinkles, triple towered scoop, raspberry swirl, strawberry and vanilla with a chocolate sauce. Looks like Buster has made his choice. Wow, thanks, Iggy. Oh, that was quick, Buster. You enjoyed that, didn't you? Another one already? Oh, hey, Digger. He's joined the queue for an ice cream. Another ice cream coming right up. Buster, you really want a third ice cream? You're not the only one who wants ice cream, Buster. Mmm, yummy. A vanilla with a chocolate flake. The queue is getting bigger. And Buster wants a fourth ice cream. Yummy, this one has a cherry on top. Okay now, Buster, I think you've had enough. Digger and Billy are waiting patiently for their ice cream, and you are being greedy. Looks like Iggy has had enough of Buster's behavior. Ha, <laughs> you want more ice cream, Buster? Here you go. Ha, <laughs> look, it's Buster the ice cream. It's definitely still missing some toppings, though. A tasty chocolate flake and a cherry. Oh. Yummy. <laughs> that has definitely cooled Buster down. <laughs> Billy is enjoying that cherry. And Digger is tucking into a big scoop off the top. This Buster ice cream is really tasty. I'm sure Buster will think twice before he's greedy again. Thanks, Iggy, for some wonderful tasty ice cream. Ice cream really is as good as it looks. There's Buster and Scout. They're having great fun playing in all the muddy puddles. But, oh no. Poor Scout is feeling a bit sick. 
Aw, it's okay. They can play together again tomorrow. Now Buster is heading inside and grabbing a snack. But, oh dear, he's not washed his muddy wheels before eating that apple. That's not very clean. And he's left muddy wheel prints everywhere. The next morning, Mommy comes to wake up Buster. But, oh no! Buster doesn't look well at all. Poor Buster. Whoa, he's got a temperature. He'll have to stay home today to get better. Now it's time for some medicine. Buster doesn't like the look of it, but Mommy knows it'll help him get better. There, that wasn't so bad. Now Buster just has to get some rest. The next morning, Buster is feeling much better. Scout's feeling better too. They can go outside and play again. But wait, Mommy says they should wash their hands first so they won't get ill again. Good job, everyone. Wait, Mommy has another idea. They can wear these face masks too so they don't get sick. There! Now Buster and Scout are ready to play outside safely. They're so happy now that they're feeling better again. Buster and his friends are having a great time camping in the woods with Daddy Bus. Daddy is making some spooky shadows as he tells them a ghost story. Whoa, that monster is super scary! Phew, don't worry, gang. It's only Daddy Bus. Looks like it's time for bed. Good night, everyone. Daddy Bus is off to collect some more firewood for the fire. Good night, Buster. Hang on. What is Buster up to? He's turning the firewood into scary antlers. Scout is fast asleep. Yikes! What is that? <gasps> it's Buster's scary shadow. Poor Scout. <laughs> Don't worry, Scout. It was only Buster. <laughs> now it's Bandit's turn to be pranked. Aha! The spooky shadow scared him as well. Looks like Buster is getting sleepy. But Bandit and Scout have a plan. Buster is sleeping peacefully. But there's a scary monster! And another one! Go, Buster, go! That served Buster right. Great job, gang. What is that? Oh, no! It's a real spooky monster! Phew! It was just Daddy Bus carrying back more firewood. That's enough scaring for one evening. All that joking around has made them very tired. Hey there, Buster. Hey, little Robin. That's right, Buster. Look both ways before crossing the tracks. Whoa, that was a close one. Wasn't Suki the train looking where she was going? There's Otis the police car. Something must be wrong. Quick, Buster, maybe you can help. Oh no, Suki has fallen asleep on the job. If someone doesn't stop her, who knows where she'll end up? What are we going to do? Wait, I think Buster has an idea. A rope? Good thinking, Buster. You can use that to slow Suki down. Nice catch, Robin. That's it. Pull! Cool. You can do it. Oh no, the rope snapped. Suki is still out of control. I think she's going faster now. You've got to catch up with her, quick! What's Buster seeing now? Oh dear, it's Digger. Suki is heading right towards him and he hasn't even noticed. Another track, it goes up a hill too. Look out, Buster. Phew, that was close. 
Well ducked, Buster. You need to change the tracks, Buster, so Suki goes up the hill. Hurry, Buster. You can do it. Almost there. Yes, just in time. Well done, Buster. You changed the track. Suki is heading up a steep hill. That'll slow her down. There. At last, she stopped safely. I think Suki is waking up. Thank goodness nobody was hurt. Well done, Buster. You helped Otis and saved the day. Daddy Bus and Buster are visiting the river today. What are they going to get up to? Oh, boats! How exciting! Buster wants to ride the boat. But wait, not yet. First, Daddy Bus wants to teach Buster how to tie a strong knot so the boat doesn't float away. Daddy Bus has tied a great knot. Now it's Buster's turn. Aw, oh, nearly there. That's okay, Buster. Tying strong knots is really hard. Daddy Bus is going to show Buster how to do it again. But Buster isn't very interested in tying knots. Hmm, the boat is right there. And Daddy is concentrating very hard on his knot. Buster's off. This is much more fun. Oh no, the boat wasn't tied to the dock. The river is carrying Buster away. Buster's trying to paddle back, but he can't seem to steer. Daddy Bus to the rescue. Uh-oh, that boat has a leak. He needs to find another way. Buster is floating even further down the river. Careful, Daddy Bus. What's Buster going to do? Oh, there's a bridge. Buster's grabbing on. Phew. Oh no, the pole broke off. Daddy Bus just missed him. Look out! Uh-oh, Buster has spotted rocks ahead. But he can use the wooden pole to steer away from them. It's working! Good thinking, Buster. Oh no, the pole snapped! And look, a waterfall ahead! What's Daddy pointing to? A rope! Perfect! The waterfall isn't far away now. You can do it! Go, Buster! Nice throw! Daddy Bus is pulling Buster back to the shore. Nearly there. Just a bit further. Phew! Back on dry land. Now Buster and Daddy are fishing instead. That's much more relaxing. It's Halloween, and Buster is at Daddy's house. Oh, but Halloween can be scary. Daddy Bus has an idea. He's going to tell a Halloween story. Daddy's going to tell a story of the brave wizard's adventure to find the magic gems and save Halloween. Buster the brave wizard went on an adventure. He had to find all the magic gems. There must be gems in that castle. They're guarded by a monster. This wizard must be very brave, Dad. The wizard was the bravest of all, Buster. The hero presses on through the dark woods towards the castle. Something stirs in the darkness up ahead in the forest. What is it, Dad? A werewolf? A ghost? A were-ghost! The mysterious shadow grows larger. Is it the monster? He 
found a jewel. Well done. <laughs> Finally, the wizard reached the mysterious castle. There must be more gems inside, huh? but how to get there? <laughs> he needs to lower the drawbridge, but how? The wizard could use his magic. <laughs> Good idea. The brave adventurer pushed forward inside the castle walls. Onward, into the castle. How brave the wizard is. What will our hero do? Run or continue? Continue, continue. The wizard has to find the treasure and save Halloween. <laughs> But what's that behind them? It's the monster! If the wizard wants to get those magic jewels, he'll need to get past it. Wait, Daddy. The monster must be really lonely. Oh, I suppose so, yes. The monster is lonely. Maybe the wizard should help the monster. He needs a friend. And so, the brave wizard rolled up and used his magic to make the castle all warm and bright. <laughs> the monster is you, Dad! <laughs> the monster was so grateful he gave the wizard all the magic jewels. So brave Buster <laughs> saved Halloween for everyone. It's Buster and Robin. Buster looks like he's enjoying that bubblegum a lot. What's that? A message in a bottle. I wonder what it is. Whoa! It's a treasure map. X marks the spot. Buster and Robin are going to find the buried treasure. Now which way should they go? There's the jetty. And look! There's the desert island. They found it. Uh-oh. The water is full of sharks. They'll need to find a safe way across. <laughs> Look, it's Katrina, the steamboat. She's stuck on the beach. She could use a push back into the water. That's it, Buster. Well done. Great. Katrina is back on the water. But oh dear, there's a hole. Katrina could sink if someone doesn't fix it. I think Buster has a plan. I wonder what he's doing with the bubble gum. Oh! He's using the bubble gum to block up the hole. Very clever, Buster. The sharks won't catch them now. Next stop, the desert island. Great! Buster's arrived on the island. Now he just needs to find the treasure. It's around here somewhere. There! X marks the spot. Buster's digging down. Wow! A treasure chest! Look! A coin! I wonder what Buster will use it for. Look! Diggly is working on Katrina, fixing up her leak. Oh! Buster is using the coin to pay Diggly. He's helping Katrina get fixed to say thank you to his new friend. What a fun adventure! Hey, Buster. <laughs> Looks like another day to have fun. Oh, no. It's Bandit the bus. Buster, watch out. You will crash. Wait, what's happening? Oh, wow. You're floating in the air. Oh. <laughs> this is incredible, Buster. <laughs> I wonder if you can fly. Oh, wow. You've turned into a superhero. You are so fast! Super Buster is here! Woohoo! What has Buster seen? It's Otis the police car. I wonder what Otis is looking for inside the tunnel. Wait, it's Bandit the bus. What is he up to? This doesn't look good. Oh no! He's pushed the boulder over the edge and trapped oh. Otis in the tunnel. <laughs> You've got to save him, Buster. You can't let Bandit the bus get away with this. That boulder looks very heavy. It's okay, Buster. You're a superhero now. You can save him. Oh, Buster, your eyes. Wow, you have laser vision. Well done, Buster. You've set Otis free. Now let's catch that naughty Bandit bus. There's Bandit. Looks like he's up to no good again. Scout, watch out. 
course, Gout. <laughs> Look who it is. You're in trouble now. Super Buster is here. Buster, you can stop him. <laughs> Super Buster is too strong for Bandit. That should stop him. Phew. Now Buster just needs to help Scout out of the <laughs> pond. <laughs> Look at Bandit. He's stuck now. Oh, it was all just a daydream. I don't think the teacher is very happy. <laughs> it's almost Christmas. But looks like it hasn't snowed yet. Aw. Hmm, what is Buster doing? <laughs> Buster has made a Christmas picture frame for his best friend, Scout. It looks amazing. Well done, Buster. <laughs> He wants to give Scout the present right now, but he's got to get ready first. It's starting to snow. Ta-da! It's Santa Buster! He's dressed up as Santa. Time to take the present to Scout. She's going to be so happy. Oh no! There's so much snow! How are they going to reach the Christmas market? Careful, Buster. Ice can be very slippery. Uh-oh. Buster is sliding all over the place. Look out. Oopsie. Daddy to the rescue. It's all right, Buster. I think Daddy has an idea. I wonder what Daddy is doing. Wow, a sled. They can cross the snow on that. Yuppie, this is going to be fun! Oh, Buster, wait! Buster's going so fast, Daddy can barely keep up! Oh, slow down, Buster! It's lucky he landed in that big pile of snow. Oh, Daddy is in trouble too! Look out! Aw, maybe next time Buster should wait for Daddy to help. Huh? Oh no, the sled is broken. How are they going to get to the market now? Hmm, but maybe Buster has an idea. Aha! Buster stuck two bits of the broken sled together. What's he built? <laughs> Oh, it's a snowplow! <laughs> Go, Buster! They've done it! They've reached the road safely! Now to get the present to Scout! <laughs> There's Scout at the Christmas market! And here's Buster! Time to give her the present at last! Aww! Scout loved her present! She's feeling so grateful. Well done, Buster, and Merry Christmas. <laughs> it's a sunny day in the school playground, and Buster and Scout are drawing together. Uh-oh, looks like they both want the blue crayon. Buster snatches it, and now Scout is trying to snatch it back. It's given Buster and Bandit a great idea for a game they can all play together. <laughs> Using their imaginations. <laughs> it's cops and robbers. Buster and Bandit are the robbers. And Ash and Scout are the cops trying to catch them. Off they go. The chase is on. Buster and Bandit are splitting up. Oh no, Bandit is cornered. Aha, he's got a plan. Where has he gone? Hang on a second, that box is moving. Quick, Ash, you can catch him. He's jumping off that ramp. Go, Buster! 
I wonder if Buster and Bandit are going to escape. They're all getting very close. Whoa, watch out! Buster and Bandit have driven straight into jail. Hooray for the cops, Scout, and Ash. Time to give up the crayon, Buster. <laughs> that was fantastic. What a brilliant game. Now Scout can finally finish off her drawing. Buster and Bandit are free to go. What a fantastic playtime, everyone. It's Halloween. Ash and Scout are at Buster's house, ready to go trick-or-treating. Whoa, that zombie costume looks amazing. Bandit is not impressed. Boo! Nope, Bandit doesn't want to join in. He thinks dressing up is for babies. Buster, Scout, and Ash head off on their trick-or-treating adventure. Hang on, Bandit would really like some Halloween sweets. <gasps> Looks like he's got an idea. <gasps> Bandit has copied Buster's costume. They look exactly the same. He's arrived at Terry's farm looking like Buster. Trick or treat? Wow, look at all those sweeties. Oh look, Buster, Ash, and Scout have arrived. Some sweeties for Scout? Some sweeties for Ash? Hang on. Nope, Terry thinks he's already given Buster lots of sweets, but it was actually Naughty Bandit. Poor Buster. Ash and Scout like how they look in their reflections. What is that? A sweet wrapper? And another? It's Bandit eating all the sweets! Buster has a plan. Ash and Scout are pretending to think that Bandit is Buster. Bandit is looking at himself in the reflection. Wait a second, now there are two bandits. Bandit is a bit confused and a bit scared. Where have the others gone? Buster's plan worked. Bandit has been caught in the act. And here's Terry with more sweets. He's confused by the two zombies. He's given them to Bandit again. But Bandit is sharing it with Buster. What a funny mix-up. Happy Halloween! Buster and Mommy Bus are visiting Terry's farm today. <laughs> yeah. Wow, the farm is so cool. Buster is so excited. <laughs> oh, look, an adorable litter of puppies. How cute. Buster has spotted a soccer ball. He loves soccer. <laughs> <laughs> Mommy Bus is here to check that all the puppies are healthy, but Buster has other ideas. He wants to go and play some soccer on the farm. <laughs> what was that? One of the puppies followed Buster outside. Looks like she wants to play. Hmm, but Buster wants to play by himself. 
There she is again! The puppy won't stop following him! Buster is throwing the puppy a stick to distract her! That will make her leave! Nope, that didn't work! And now the puppy has taken the soccer ball! What a cheeky little puppy! Aha! Finally, Buster got his ball back! But the puppy still wants to play! Stay there, puppy! Buster is hiding behind a stack of hay bales! <gasps> Not again! <gasps> Maybe Buster can lose the puppy in the cornfield. The puppy is sad she can't find him, but Buster's plan worked. Oh no! How did that puppy get up there? She's going to fall! And Mommy Bus and Terry haven't noticed! Quick, Buster, quick! Go, Buster! Phew! He saved the puppy! That was a close one! Oh. Mommy Bus has noticed a puppy is missing! But don't worry, Buster has brought her home! What a fun day at the farm! Uh-oh, not again! Buster is at Daddy's house today! Oh look, it's Daddy Bus! Tomorrow, Buster is going back to school. <laughs> it's going to be great. But first, they need to get ready. Daddy Bus has a checklist of everything Buster needs before he goes back to school tomorrow. <laughs> he needs his rucksack, a lunchbox, his school book, a pencil case, and a ruler. Hmm. Rucksack, check. Lunchbox, Check. Everything else? Check. And last but not least, the shark tooth from his holiday for show and tell. Wow. Buster needs to get a good night's sleep before school tomorrow. Good night, Buster. There goes the alarm! It must be time to get up! Oh no! Buster has gone back to sleep! Oh dear! And now he's going to be late for school! Quick! They've got to get everything ready! Huh? What does Buster need? Rucksack? Check! Lunchbox? Check! Pencil case and school book, check. But what is he missing? The ruler. Aha, there it is. It's time to head off for school. Wait a second, Buster forgot his shark tooth. <gasps> quick, Buster, quick. Shark tooth? Check! They're going to have to race to get there on time! Go, Buster! Looks like the teacher is getting worried! All his friends are already at school and he's going to be late! Oh no! Phew! He did it! Just in time! What a crazy morning! Buster is having so much fun playing on his drum kit! Oops! There goes a drumstick! It's rolling over to Mommy! Hmm, what's Mommy doing? 
Oh, she's clearing out all Buster's old toys. The ones he doesn't use anymore. I wonder what's inside. Look, Buster's baby drum. He remembers that. Mommy is going to recycle it so someone else can enjoy it. Buster is sad. But he has a bigger, better drum kit now. But Buster wants to keep his little drum. He doesn't like to let go. Here's Scout with her tambourine. She's come round to play. Hooray! Time to make some music. Buster and Scout are ready to play. And here's Ash, too. He's come to listen. Now Buster and Scout have an audience. They're ready to rock. One, two, three, four. Nice. Buster and Scout are really grooving. Nice work, guys. Scout shakes the tambourine. Buster bangs the drum. Oh, he's trying to play his little drum at the same time. That doesn't work so well. He's trying to do too much at once. Oops. Aw, Ash wants to join in. But he doesn't have an instrument. And Buster has one too many. What's he going to do? Buster is giving his little drum to Ash to play. Now Ash can play along. And all three of them can have fun. Ready? One, two, three, four. There. That sounds even better than before. At the end of the day, Ash is going to give the drum back. But Buster knows he doesn't need two drums. He wants Ash to keep it. Ash is so happy. What a kind thing Buster it's did. It's Halloween, and Buster is having a party. He's looking for a cool costume to make himself super scary. What has he found? Whoa, Buster is dressed up as a cowboy. Awesome. Time to put this costume to the test. Boo, Buster tries to scare mommy. Did it work? Hmm, maybe the cowboy costume isn't scary enough. He needs to find something scarier. Mm. <laughs> Aha! He's got it! Arr! He's a pirate! This is going to be much scarier. Oops! Be careful, Buster! There's Grandpa Bus! Scare him, Buster! Arr! Oh dear, Buster is still not scary enough. But looks like he's got an idea. Hang on a second, where has Grandpa's laundry gone? It's time for snacks. <laughs> What was that? There's a noise coming from that shed. But what is making that noise? It's a bit spooky. <gasps> ah, it's a g -g -g ghost! <laughs> Wait a second, I recognize that giggle. It was Buster all along! <laughs> that was definitely a scary costume. Sounds like people have arrived for the party. And Mommy has a plan. Ash and Scout have arrived. They're so excited! Hmm, there's nobody there. They're a little bit scared. <gasps> what is that? Boo! Ah! Run away! <laughs> Don't worry, Ash and Scout. It was just Buster. <laughs> what a great prank and a very scary costume. Buster and his friends look so excited. What's going on? 
Oh, wow! Mommy has set up an Easter egg hunt for them. What's that? I think Scout is really excited about having some yummy chocolate. Ready and go! Everyone's going to look for the Easter eggs. Oops! Try not to bump into each other. Nice! Ash found an egg in that tree. He's rushing back and putting it in the basket so they can all share it later. Good job, Ash! Ooh, I think Buster has seen an egg too. Wait, this is just the wrapping paper. Where's the chocolate egg gone? Buster's disappointed. But look, there's another egg by the bush. Hmm, this one's just wrapping too. Someone has taken the chocolate. Very strange. Oh dear, Ash is worried. They haven't found enough eggs to share around. But it's okay, they'll just have to keep looking. What's this? Another empty bit of wrapping. There's Bandit. He's sneaky. Maybe he's been stealing all the chocolate? He's got some eggs. But look, he's putting them in the basket. It's not Bandit who's stealing them. Look, there goes Scout. She'll know what to do. But wait. Is that chocolate around Scout's mouth? She's the one stealing all the eggs. Look, Scout hid all the eggs she found behind that bush. She loves chocolate so much, she wanted them all to herself. But she's very sorry. She knows sharing is the right thing to do. Buster forgives her, but they'd better clean that chocolate off her face. There, Mommy can share them out equally. Ash, Bandit, Buster, Scout. Everyone get some yummy Easter eggs. Oh no! Bandit Bus is stealing from the candy shop. Stop, thief! It's Otis the police car. He's come to investigate the case of the stolen candy. Bandit Bus went that way, Otis. I don't think Otis saw Bandit Bus get away. Great idea, Otis. Follow the trail of candy. I think we know who it will lead to. There he is. Stop, thief. Look, Otis, some more clues. Keep following the trail. Wow, Bandit Bus is dropping a lot of candy. Oh, hey, Buster. Oh, I don't think that candy is for you. Buster loves candy. Oh, dear, the trail of candy has led straight to Buster the Bus. Otis must think that Buster is the thief. You've made a mistake, Otis. Buster is innocent. Poor Buster, what are you going to do? Otis is putting Buster in jail. Oh, Buster. Oh, here comes Scout. Maybe Scout can help Buster get out of jail. You have to help Buster, Scout. Prove he's innocent. That's right, Scout. Follow the trail of candy to find the truth. Scout the detective is on the case. There he is. Bandit Bus caught red-handed stealing from the toy shop. You're going down this time, Bandit Bus. Stop right there, in the name of the law. You're under arrest. It's time to put things right and get Buster out of jail. Come on out, Buster, you're innocent. And in goes Bandit the Bus. Thanks, Scout, you're a great detective. If it wasn't for you, Buster would still be locked up. I'm sorry, Bandit Bus, but you had it coming. Stealing is against the law. Well done, Otis. Bye, Bandit. It's evening time, and Buster's cousin Bandit is coming for a sleepover. <laughs> this is going to be so much fun. First, it's time for a snack. I wonder what it will be. Oh, wow! Cookies! They look so tasty! Buster and Bandit love cookies. There, one each. <laughs> Yummy. Now Mommy's put them away. But Bandit knows where they are. Bandit and Buster have such a fun evening playing together. But then it's time for bed. They want to stay up longer. But Mommy says no. Hmm, 
I think Bandit has an idea. I wonder what he's whispering. Now, everyone's fast asleep. But what's this? Bandit's waking up. Buster, too. They're sneaking back downstairs. Oh, Bandit is going to steal some more cookies. That's very naughty. Oops, that made a loud noise. Mommy's caught them. She's very disappointed in Buster and Bandit. The two little buses are very sorry. They'll go back to bed now as they're told. But the next morning, Buster and Bandit have surprised Mommy by making breakfast. They wanted to show how sorry they were. It's the end of school, and it's time for Scout to return the school flower that she'd been taking care of. Now whose turn is it to take it home and care for it? Hooray! It's Buster's turn! Buster is going really slowly. He wants to make sure he takes good care of the flower. It's time to say goodbye to Scout and Ash. Whoa! Careful, Buster! That was a close one! Buster is so happy to be caring for the flower that he's drawn a picture of it. He's even brought it to dinner! <laughs> I don't think it eats carrots, Buster. It needs water instead to make sure it grows strong. But now it's time for bed. Good night, flower. The next morning, Buster is super excited for school. Careful, Buster. You don't want to knock the flower. Oh, no. The flower has smashed. What is Buster doing? He's hiding it because he's afraid he'll get in trouble. Hmm, Buster is pretending to be ill. But he doesn't have a temperature. Oh, now Mommy understands. Buster doesn't want to go to school with the smashed flower. He thinks he's let everyone down. But Mommy knows what to do. They'll put the flower in a brand new pot. It looks even better than before. There, good as new. Buster returns the flower to class. Everyone is really impressed with its lovely new pot. Good job, Buster. Now it's Ash's turn to take care of it. Hooray! Buster, Mommy Bus, and Ash are at the Soft Play Center. How exciting! Looks like Buster wants to play in the big kids section, but he's not quite big enough yet. Wow, this is amazing! Ash is very excited, but Buster thinks he's too old for soft play. They're having so much fun! Look at them go! But Buster doesn't want to join. Now they're bouncing on the trampoline! Whee! That does look like lots of fun, Buster! Nope, he's still not going to play. What is Ash running from? Oh, look, it's Captain Mommy! Arg! Quick, run away, Ash! He's escaped to the ball pit. That looks like so much fun! Now Buster wants to join in. Quick, the captain is going to catch you. Go, Buster! Buster is really getting into this now. Ahoy, me hearties! <gasps> what was that? <laughs> gotcha! It's Pirate Buster and Pirate Ash to the rescue. Run away! <laughs> Look at them go! Watch out, Captain Mommy! Pirate Buster and Pirate Ash have saved the day! 
See, Buster? The soft play center was lots of fun after all. It looks like you're all covered in mud. You had a lot of fun splashing through those muddy puddles. <laughs> it looks like Buster might need a wash. I'm not sure if he thinks so. Here comes the city bus. Oh dear, he doesn't look very impressed at how dirty Buster is. It looks like Buster has finally realized just how messy he looks. That's right, Buster. You're covered in mud. Is that a sign for a car wash? <laughs> Great idea, Buster. Off he goes to the car wash to clean himself up. Oh, poor Buster. He's too scared to go inside. It does look very scary, doesn't it? Go on, Buster. You can do it. You need to get clean. You're so dirty. He's going for it. Buster is being very brave indeed. One, two, three. Oh, no. You were so close, Buster. Oh, he sounds very impatient. Buster, take a deep breath. You can do it. But the sounds are so scary! Go on, Buster, you can do it. You're almost there. Ready, set, go! <laughs> You're doing it, Buster! It tickles! That's not so bad, is it? And out he comes! There, that wasn't so bad, was it, Buster? All sparkly and clean. Looking good. Wow, well done, Buster. Nice and clean. That car wash wasn't so scary after it's all. A windy day at the park. Buster and Daddy Bus are here for a fun day out. Daddy Bus has a surprise for Buster. What could it be? Oh, look, it's a kite. Buster gets ready to fly it. Daddy Bus pushes it up into the air. Wow, it's flying so high. Well done, Buster. Look, it's Monty, the hot air balloon. Oh no, a big gust of wind has blown the kite away. It's caught on Monty, and he hasn't noticed. Don't worry, Buster. Daddy has a plan. Oops, watch out, Daddy Bus. Whoa, great header. Go, Buster. Bandit and Ash look very confused. Where are they going? Buster is trying to get Monty's attention. But he's not looking where he's going. Watch out! Oh no! Buster has driven straight into a muddy puddle. He's stuck in the mud. Daddy heaves him out. Great teamwork, guys. Uh-oh, a tree has fallen across the road. But that won't stop them. Daddy Bus flies right over the log. And Buster slides straight underneath. Wow, that was awesome! <laughs> Quick, there's Monty! <laughs> Looks like Daddy Bus has an idea. There's a huge pile of mud and they're splashing through it. What are they doing? They've drawn a picture of their kite in the mud and Monty has finally noticed the kite wrapped around him. Oops! <laughs> Buster gets his kite back. Ah. Thank you, Monty. Hold tight, Buster. Phew, that was a close one. Buster, Bandit, and Mira are outside playing with their soccer ball. Daddy Bus is fishing. <sighs> he hasn't caught any fish yet. Buster has some great skills. Whoa, and so does Mira. That's a big kick, Bandit. Watch out, Mira. Oh no, the ball knocked Mira's hat off. Where did it go? It's not over here. It's definitely not over there. Mira is upset that her favorite hat is missing. Don't worry, Mira, we'll help you find it. Buster has an idea. We can look for the hat using our imagination. Now we can turn the search into a fun game. Off they go. It's time to look for that hat. 
Oh. Whoa! Oh. Those are very big footprints. Oh. 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 They decide to follow them and see where they go. <laughs> Stop! What's oh. that up ahead? <gasps> it's a dinosaur! And he's wearing Mira's hat! Uh-oh! Run! They're going as fast as they can, but the dinosaur isn't far behind. And Buster spots a big volcano up ahead. They've got to get over that puddle. Buster and Mira make it, but oh no! Bandit gets stuck! Buster is trying to help Bandit get out. <gasps> Uh-oh! The dinosaur caught up with them! He looks very scary! But what's the dinosaur doing? He's seen his reflection! And I think he likes the hat. But that's Mira's hat, and she wants it back. Looks like she has an idea. <laughs> wow! Nice shot, Mira! The ball knocks the hat right off! Oh no! But looks like the hat is flying straight towards the volcano! How are they going to get it back now? Buster can do it using his imagination. It's Super Buster! Off he flies to save the hat. It's getting closer and closer to the volcano. He needs to be quick. Go, Buster! He got it! Thanks, Buster. You're a great friend. They played a fun game, and Mira got her favorite hat back. <laughs> Everything is more fun when you use your imagination. Buster and Scout are on their way home from school. Bye, Scout. What's Buster spotted? Oh, look, it's Diggly and Daisy. Buster wants to help. But safety first. Look at that awesome builder's hat. Buster is helping them move a crate off Rocky the Riverboat. Great teamwork, guys! Now they're placing the crate on the construction site. Mr. Rubble is off to get some lunch. See you later, Mr. Rubble! Oh no! The crate is sinking into the mud! Go, Buster, go! Oh no! Now Buster is stuck in the mud as well! Daisy to the rescue! <gasps> nope, that didn't work. What's that? Diggly is hooked up to that crane. And he's pulling Buster out! It's working! Just a little bit more. Oops! Now they're all stuck! And Mr. Rubble hasn't noticed. But Buster's got a plan. He's wrapping the wire around the crane and attaching it to the crate so they can pull themselves out. Brilliant idea, Buster! Diggly and Daisy are both pulling the rope at different times. But they need to work together. That's it! Hooray! It worked! <gasps> Mr. Rubble still hasn't noticed them. So they quickly pull the crate out. Everything is back to normal. Well, not quite back to normal. They're all covered in mud. It's time to get cleaned up. Mr. Rubble is spraying them with the hose. There, that's much better. Now it's time for a spot of lunch. Yum, yum. But what's that? Mr. Rubble has driven straight into the mud. 
Don't worry, Mr. Rubble. They know just what to do. Another exciting day at school for Buster and his friends. Today, they are making Mother's Day cards. Look, teacher is showing them how to do it. Fold it in half and make a crease. Well done, Buster. But what is Bandit up to? Wow, look at all those decorations. Let's craft. Oh, Bandit, he's turned his card into a paper airplane and it's gone flying. Buster's starting with some glue. Oops, the glue is stuck to his wheel. And now there's glitter everywhere. Oh dear, Buster. The glue just won't budge. Hmm, what can Buster use to remove the glue? Aha, a spoon. Nope, that didn't work. Uh-oh, and now the spoon is stuck to his other wheel. Buster asks Scout for some help. Scout tries to pull off the glue bottle. Nope, that didn't work either. Oh no, now Scout is stuck as well. Watch out, Scout. Oh dear, this isn't going to plan. Bandit is finding all of this very funny. And the poor teacher is too distracted by Bandit's plane, he can't see what's going on. Oops, they've knocked over Ash's water. But hang on, the water has loosened the spoon. Buster has an idea. Ash is using his hose to unstick the glue. Hooray! It worked! Oh dear, what a mess! Mommy Bus is here to take Buster home. And look, Buster is giving her the special Mother's Day card. She loves it! Happy Mother's Day, Mommy Bus. Uh-oh, not again! Here, Buster, what have you got there? An ice cream! <laughs> it sure looks delicious. What's wrong, Buster? Oh, you've got a wobbly tooth. That's not good at all. Huh? I think Buster has been eating too much sugar. Oh dear, that does look painful. Poor Buster. Oh, great idea, Robin. Huh? Buster should go to the dentist to get that bad tooth looked at. Oh, come on, Buster. It's not that scary. That's a tasty looking lollipop. <laughs> but I don't think it's any good for your bad tooth. Uh. Ooh, that looked like it really hurt. What about an apple, Buster? Something with a little less sugar in it? Huh? I think Buster's afraid mm. to eat anything now. <laughs> oh dear, that tooth is still hurting. Poor Buster. He can't stay like this. That's it, Robin. Go and get some help. <laughs> Look who it is. It's Amber the ambulance. Oh. She'll know what huh? to do. Don't be afraid, Buster. Uh -huh. Amber is here to help. You just have to be brave. <laughs> Open wide. <laughs> Come on, Buster. Open up nice and wide so Amber can see your tooth. Let's have a look. That looks very painful, Buster. It looks like you're going to lose your first milk tooth. And then you will get your big teeth. <laughs> Amber knows what will help. A toothbrush. Squeeze the toothpaste out of the tube <laughs> and brush from side to side. That's it, Buster. All nice and clean. And a quick rinse. It's very Aha. important to look after your teeth. Well done, Buster. An ice pack will mm. soothe the pain. <sighs> That's better. You see, that wasn't so scary, was it? <sighs> Thanks, Amber. Oh, wow, look, Buster. Your oh. wobbly tooth has fallen out. <laughs> That's much better, isn't it? And a new tooth will grow in its place soon. Well done, Buster. You are very... Buster and his friends are back at school. They are telling each other what they got up to over the summer. Buster is so excited to tell everyone about his shark tooth. But first, Scout is telling everyone what she got up to over the summer. This summer, I went surfing for the first time ever. It was so cool. There was this one wave I saw that was absolutely massive. But I still got to surf it without falling off. And I went so fast. Scoot, scoot. Wow, Scout told such a cool story. Huh. What's wrong with Buster? Mm. Oh, he thinks his shark tooth story won't be interesting enough after Scout's story. Hmm. Ah. Buster is going to tell everyone how he got the tooth. 
This summer, I went exploring in the deep, dark <laughs> wood. It's full of animals and monsters, but I wasn't afraid one bit. <laughs> Then, I came face to face with a dinosaur. <gasps> but he had a sore tooth. So I took it out for him to make him feel all better. Wait a second, that's not right. Dinosaurs are extinct. Oh dear, Bandit thinks Buster isn't telling the truth. He couldn't really meet a dinosaur. Could he? Oh. <gasps> All right. It's not really a dinosaur tooth. Mm. It's a shark tooth. I thought that wouldn't be mm. interesting enough. But Buster, sharks are way cooler than dinosaurs. Go Buster, tell us the story. <laughs> this summer, I was at the beach, but then I saw, mm. no, Yes! Oh. Pirates are even cooler than sharks! <laughs> Yarma hearties! <laughs> hmm. Okay. The pirates and me, we found a shark, but he had a sore tooth. So we decided oh. to take the tooth hmm. out with a little help from a friendly little bee! <laughs> we took out the sore tooth and then they played catch with it! <laughs> and they played on the beach all day long. What a great story! It's so much fun to use your imagination, especially with friends. Buster looks so excited. I wonder why. A storybook. Buster wants Mommy to read to him. Buster loves a good fairy tale. <laughs> Mommy's reading Buster the story of Goldilocks and the three bears. When the bears had gone out, Goldilocks came to the window. She tried their porridge, but the first bowl was too hot. Buster thinks that's very funny. But look at the time. Mommy can't read all day. Buster's upset. He wants to know what happens next in the story. But Mommy knows what to do. Maybe Grandpa can read to Buster? Grandpa is out watering the plants, but Buster wants him to read more of the storybook. Yes, Grandpa can read to him for a bit. He loves stories of great adventures and brave heroes. What's happening now? Goldilocks sits on a chair that's too small, and it breaks. How funny. Buster loves this story. But what's this? Mommy says it's time for dinner. The rest of the story will have to wait. Buster has some nice fish fingers and vegetables for dinner, but he's eating them all really fast. He wants to get back to the story as soon as possible. Hmm, Mommy and Grandpa are still eating. They can't read to him right now. Buster really wants to know what happens next. Look, he's trying to read it himself. He's not very good at reading, but he's trying really hard. Wow, he's getting it. Mommy and Grandpa are so proud of him. Good job, Buster. But, oh dear, he's getting sleepy too. Mommy's reading the book to Buster as a bedtime story. Now Goldilocks is asleep in the bear's bed. Oh, look, Buster has fallen asleep. Aw, he'd had such a busy day, he couldn't stay awake for the end. Good night, Buster. It's Jessie the Jeep. She's got a cake. Wow, that looks tasty. But here comes Bandit Bus. He looks mischievous. <laughs> oh no! He's eating Jesse's cake. That's not fair at all. Poor Jesse. There's Buster the bus. And there's Bandit driving too fast. <sighs> Look, Buster's gone to play with Scout. He's given her a soccer ball as a present. Look at Scout go! Look at that! Diggly is building a colorful tower. But here comes Bandit. I wonder what that awful bully is up to. Oh no! 
He's knocked over Diggly's tower. Bandit is a menace. Uh-oh, he's seen Scout's ball. Bandit is stealing the ball for himself. What a bully. Buster wants to do something. Poor Scout is really upset. Buster wants to help his friend. He's going to stand up to Bandit and get him to give the ball back. I don't think Bandit will listen to Buster. He's going to bully him instead. It's not fair. But wait, Jesse is standing beside Buster. Scout is here to help too. They're all fed up with Bandit being a bully. There's Otis, the police car, enjoying an ice cream. Oops, Bandit has backed into Otis. Otis looks mad. Serves Bandit right, being mean to everyone. Now Buster, Scout, and Jesse can play soccer in peace. It's a brand new snowy day. And Buster can't wait to go outside and play. It's so much fun to play in the snow. And the best game of all is a snowball fight. Diggly and Scout are on one team, but Buster needs a teammate. Look, there's Bandit. He can be on Buster's team, though Buster and Bandit don't always get along. Time to start throwing snowballs. Buster and Bandit are hiding behind that hill. Hmm. Buster thinks they should go this way, but Bandit thinks they should go that way. Oh dear, they can't agree. They're not working together as a team. Buster is sneaking through the trees, but Scout has spotted him. Look out! Oh dear. Bandit is trying to sneak behind the fence. Buster and Bandit aren't doing very well. But look, Scout and Diggly are working together. That's it. If Buster and Bandit want to win, they'll need to work together like a team. Whoosh, off they go. And that's more like it. Now it's a real fun snowball fight. It's much better with teamwork. <laughs> Who threw that snowball? <gasps> Grandpa! The more players, the more fun it is. Hey there, Buster. My, you're looking messy today. It's so much fun to play in the muddy puddles. Come on now, Buster. Time to go to the car wash. You'll be squeaky clean again in no time. <laughs> hey there, Tony Truck. Whoops, he knocked out the power cable. <gasps> oh no! The car wash is turned off and Buster is stuck inside. Quick, Scout. Buster needs your help. He's really stuck tight. Maybe if you give him a push. Ugh, it's no good. He won't budge. It'll be okay, Buster. Scout's going to get help. Be brave. Wow, here comes Scout. And she's brought Ashley the fire truck, Amber the ambulance, and Otis the police car with her. You'll be okay now, Buster. The emergency vehicles are here to help. I think Ashley has a plan. Grab hold of that rope, Buster. They're going to drag you free. All together now, everybody. Heave! Hard as you can. Come on, everyone. What's this? Scout spotted the plug that got knocked out. Maybe if she plugs it back in... Yes! 
The car wash is back on, and Buster is free. Oh, thank goodness for that. Good teamwork, everybody. <laughs> it's fall, and Buster the Bus and his friends are outside playing. <laughs> Look at all the leaves falling off the trees. What's this? I think Scout has an idea for a game. Oh, Scout wants to play hide and seek. What a great idea. You count, Buster, whilst everybody else goes and hides. Tony the truck is hiding in the barn. Jesse the Jeep is hiding under that box. Diggly the digger is going to dig a hole behind those bushes. Quick, Scout. You need to find somewhere to hide before Buster is done counting. But where? Three, two, one. Coming, ready or not. Where is everyone? Buster's going to seek. Is anyone hiding in that barn? Yes! You found Tony the truck, Buster! What about these boxes? Is anyone hiding here? I guess not. Wait a minute! Is that box following you, Buster? That must mean... Yes! You found Jesse the Jeep! Good job! What about those bushes? Anyone hiding there? Look, there's Robin! Did you see that? I wonder if... That's right! You found Diggly the Digger! Hooray! That just leaves Scout. I wonder where she could be hiding. Wait, did you notice something funny about that pile of leaves? There, Scout! Well done, Buster! You found all of your friends hiding places! Wasn't that fun? Oh, wow! Buster's become a rocket! And he's going to space! Five, four, three, two, one! Blast off! <laughs> Look at Buster go! All right! You did it, Buster! You're in outer space! What a cool place to be! I think Buster wants to go space exploring! Look at that! It's a red planet! Let's go in for a closer look! Hey there, little space buddy! I bet that alien has never seen a bus before! Where are you off to now, Buster? Oh, a yellow planet! It's so beautiful with that huge ring around it! Look at that! Buster's gonna go for a drive around the ring! Let's see how fast you can go! Whoa! That was fun! <laughs> What's Buster seen now? It's a purple planet! Isn't it huge? Whoa! Round and round the planets Buster goes! Round the purple planet, the yellow planet, and the red planet! But wait! Oh no! A blue planet! Buster's going too fast! I think he's going to hit it! Oh, thank goodness! It was only a dream! You're okay, Buster! Look! Scout is using her telescope to look at the night sky! Take a look, Buster! There's the purple planet, the yellow planet, and the red planet! Hello, little space buddy! Hey there, Buster! Oh, What's that? A soccer ball! Huh? Oh, look, Buster! All of your friends are lined up to play a soccer game! And they need one more player. Go on, Buster. This is going to be so much fun. Kick off. Aw, too slow, Buster. CJ, the cement mixer, is going for a shot. Can Jesse Jeep save it? Come on, Jesse. You can do it. Oh, nearly, but goal! Nice shooting, CJ. Great header, Buster! What a kick, Scout! Great block, Digger! Haha! 
Scout has played the ball of digger. <laughs> Scout's making a run for the goal. Go, Scout! You can do it. No one can tackle her. Goal! Way to go, Scout! <laughs> Jesse to Scout. Scout kicks it on. Great kick, Digger. Straight to Bandit. Oh, that was a bit rough, Bandit. Is Bandit going to score? Can Jesse save it this time? Oh, no! Jesse burst the ball. Is that the end of the game? <laughs> Oh, thank goodness. Otis has a spare ball. The game's back on. It's really heating up now. Buster's going for a run at the goal. Oh, no. Bandit Bust shoved Buster. That's a foul. Good referee, Robin. Bandit's been given a red card. Robin's sending Bandit off. That's what happens when you play too rough. Now Buster gets to take a penalty shot. Come on, Buster. You did it, Buster! <laughs> you won the game! And you won a nice trophy, too! That was so much fun! Buster is heading off to school! Wait a second, Buster! Don't forget, it's school photo day today! So you need an extra polish! Bye, Mommy Bus! Look! Terry Tractor is here to take the school photos! Bandit and Ash are up first! Smile! Buster's turn next! And he wants to get an action shot! Whoops! Buster slipped! Watch out, Scout! Oh no, what's wrong? The teacher is handing Buster a mirror. <gasps> Buster has knocked out his wobbly front tooth. Oh, no. And now Buster is too embarrassed to have his photo taken. It's OK, Buster. You can have it taken another day. Buster is feeling really sad about missing out on the photos. But Mommy Bus is here to pick him up. And she's taking him to the dentist to get his tooth looked at. Hooray! <laughs> Buster is a little bit nervous. Don't worry, Buster. Amber the ambulance is here to take a look at that tooth for you. It's time to sit in the special dentist chair. Wow, that looks like so much fun! And now it's time to check that tooth. Don't worry, Buster. There's nothing to be scared of. First, Amber is looking at the tooth with a little mirror. Open wide, Buster. Say, ah. Uh. And what's that? Amber's going to play Buster a video. It's another bus. Just like Buster! <laughs> and his tooth has fallen out! But don't worry, another one will grow in its place! He might be missing a tooth for now, but soon he'll have a brand new one! So there's nothing to be embarrassed about! <laughs> Buster now feels much better! Thanks, Amber! <laughs> And now he's going back to school to get his photo taken. <laughs> Gather in, Buster. Say cheese. Hello, Buster. It looks like you're having fun splashing through the muddy puddles. You're getting mud everywhere. And who's this? It's Terry Tractor. He's being a little more careful than Buster. Buster is having so much fun zooming through all these puddles. Oh no! He's heading straight for Terry Tractor! Phew! That was a close one. Be careful, Buster. The puddles are very slippy. Oh dear. Terry Tractor is not happy with Buster. Off he goes again. Watch where you're going this time, Buster. <laughs> Watch out! Oh no! Buster is stuck! Silly Buster. 
What's he going to do now? The sun's going down, and it's getting dark. I hope Buster is going to be okay. Look, everyone, it's Terry Tractor. He's come to save the day. Terry doesn't look too happy about it, though. Please help Buster, Terry. He just needs one big push. Can he do it? One, two, here we go! Hooray! Thanks, Terry. Oh, Buster, thank goodness Terry Tractor is there to save the day. Bye, Terry. Bye, Buster. Buster, Ash, and Mira are playing hide-and-seek tag in the soft play area. There's Buster hiding in the ball pit. Ash has found him. Now Ash is trying to tag Buster. Quick, Buster, Ash is right behind you. Oops, looks like you found Mira. Tag, well done, Ash, you got him. There's Daddy Bus. He says it's time to go. But Buster, Ash, and Amira don't want to leave yet. Looks like they have a plan. Run! And the game is on. Daddy Bus is trying to catch Buster, but Buster is too quick. Almost. Oh no, Daddy Bus has crashed into the ball pit. It's the perfect time to find somewhere to hide. Where should they go? Mira has found a place behind the play blocks. Buster has seen a space behind the slide. But Ash is already there. Quick, Buster, quick! Daddy Bus is back on the hunt for them. Now where is Buster? There he is! But Daddy Bus hasn't seen him yet. Daddy Bus spots some wheels by the play blocks. Hmm, who could it be? <laughs> it's Mira! Well found, Daddy Bus. Hmm. Now where could the others be? What was that moving behind the slide? Boo! <laughs> There's Ash! But where's Buster? There he is, hiding behind the tunnel. Looks like he has an idea to distract Daddy Bus. <laughs> What's that? A bouncy ball. Daddy Bus is going to investigate. Now Buster can find a new hiding spot. That's very sneaky. Maybe Buster can use that trampoline to help him hide. Hmm, Daddy Bus still can't find Buster anywhere. He's found a new hiding spot in the ball pit. Oh well, Daddy Bus, Ash, and Mira decide that it's time to go. Oh no, did they leave without Buster? Boo, we found you. That was very sneaky. Well done, guys. Now it's really time to go. What a fun day. Buster and Daddy Bus are having a day out at the park. Uh-oh, careful, Daddy. They're going to play some soccer together. It's time for kickoff. Buster passes the ball and... Uh-oh, looks like Daddy hasn't quite got the hang of this. But Buster shows him how it's done. Time for a penalty shootout. Buster shoots and he scores. Oh no, Daddy Bus, are you all right? Phew, he's okay. Now it's Buster's turn to be in goal. Daddy looks determined. Whoops, the ball's gone flying up in the air. Oh look, it's Ash and Mommy Fire Truck. Buster is inviting them to join the game. Great idea, Buster. It's buses versus fire trucks. Let's go! Buster takes the ball. Ash dives in front. Mommy shoots for goal and she misses. Oops. I think Buster has another idea. I wonder what it is. 
Ash and Buster are teaming up. It's now kids versus parents. Who's going to win? Ash starts. Daddy takes the ball, but Ash tackles him. He passes to Buster. And Buster scores! Go, Buster! What great teamwork, everyone! They are both very tired as Daddy drives Buster home after a great day out. Oh, look, it's Mommy Bus! Buster waves goodbye to Daddy Bus. But wait, Buster is giving Daddy Bus the soccer ball. <laughs> he does need the practice. Hey there, Buster. Whoa, look at all the spooky Halloween decorations spiders, jack o' lanterns, creepy! Uh oh, what's that? It's so big and dark. Oh, I think Buster is really scared. Don't be frightened, Buster. It's just your shadow. See? It's just the lighting shining past you. Pretty cool, isn't it? Hmm, I think this is the right way to go home. Let's go, Buster. Oh, no! The lightning struck the street lamp. Now all the lights are going out. Poor Buster. I think he's scared of the dark. But wait, what's that? The full moon's come out. That'll light up the whole town like a big lantern. Come on, Buster, off we go. Oh dear me, clouds are moving over the moon again. And now there's a lightning storm coming. Oh no, Buster is scared of the storm too. Come on, Buster, you can be brave. It's just thunder and lightning. That's right, it's not scary, it's spectacular. <laughs> nice one, Buster. You were brave and faced your fears. <laughs> Look, it's Tony the truck. He looks even more frightened by the storm than Buster. Good job, Buster. Go and help Tony. Make him feel safe. There's no need to be afraid. See? The storm is over and the moon is back. And that's just your shadow. Happy Halloween, Buster and Tony.